everybody. Welcome to episode seven. Uh, I don't have a title for this one, <laughs> except there's something lucky about this because it's the number seven, but also seven, as my dear friend Jeff pointed out a few sessions ago, is a very lucky magical number. And so there's seven Harry Potter books. There are seven Horcruxes. There are seven Weasley children. And so that means that there are seven chances for you guys to get a Harry Potter item this n- tonight. There's a lot of sevens. <laughs> I was going to say, what Harry Potter thing is Harry that? Harry Potter's not Disney. Yeah. Wait. Fuck you. Wait. Wait. Seven's not a good number. Wait, who's Harry Potter? Harry Potter. Harry Potter. The amazing young wizard. Oh, Harry oh Potter. that was weird. I'm so, awesome. you guys are currently in the middle of the Fortress of Palma. You have just oh. completed battle with several monks who are all guarding a blue focus crystal mm. that was inside of a trunk of a tree that was growing inside of the fortress. Right. Once Cameron touched that blue crystal, it shattered and turned into dust mm-hmm. and healed all of your MP up to full. Mm-hmm. You are currently in the middle of this thought that maybe you should rest, maybe you should heal, maybe you should play poker. I don't know. <laughs> but it's up to you. <laughs> I'm gonna let the dice decide. Player phase. Okay, I will all right. heal all y'alls if you want it. Well, I'm at full. So I'm at full. Um, I'm at full two. And not oh. to mention, I'm stoked right now because all of my minions are up. So Is there, uh, can you look at cameras? Do you cuddle with um, them when you sleep? Can I heal her? Yes, yes you can. <laughs> she's she's down twenty one. Okay. Cameron, Cameron no. Uh, all of it's last session because we're all unscathed. Cameron's tank, so she should be taking damage. I do heal upon her. Okay. It casts. Rawr. Shazam. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are you Captain Marvel or are you Black Adam? Nah, neither. Okay. Sorry, I just I just like that word. That was really disappointing. Twenty. Awesome. I'm disappointed that you're disappointed. <laughs> the fact I rolled a four that you're three, disappointed that for his disappointment yeah. is disappointing me. Yeah, you know I can really feel that. Everybody, give me a D twenty. You are going to inspect the room. Inspect Not what I meant, Katie. The room. <laughs> oh, I, <don't> know. <laughs> I love your. <gasps> okay. I got sixteen. Of the wagon, the door at 12. I got a 19. You all happen to see at the same time, hey, look, there's a chest right behind that tree. There's a what? Sorry. There's a chest right behind the tree. Yeah. yeah. Phobos is already like casually walking over there, like, oh, you guys just noticed? Well, guess what? I examine its magical properties (laughs) with a three. No, I don't. I don't know what's in it. Oh, shit. Drop my dice. Ooh. Okay. Sorry. What? what are you doing? Chance for a magical <laughs> drop from I have really short eyes. Chance for a magical item, folks. Fuck you, Jeff. I don't know. It happened. <gasps> we get a magical item. Oh. One. One necklace, two ring, three melee, four ranged. That's so that's so that's too meta. You don't have to tell us that. I'm saying it's not allowed for myself to remember. Yeah. <laughs> you can't do everything. Melee. But, but now, yeah. well, now we're going to know your dice rolls. But nobody here melees. <laughs> Clearly this is going to be a weapon for shambles. <laughs> shambles. <laughs> the shambles legendary the blade. Just call it Ooh, Ooh, it's a dagger. <gasps> you guys find a dagger of wind. A what? A, a da- fart dagger. A dagger of wind. <gasps> it's a fart dagger. It is a 1d4 melee weapon that gives two additional damage of wind element. That sounds painful. It's not that big of a deal, but still it's a magical item, That's so cool. take it and be merry. Yeah. Is that going to be more beneficial to anybody else than it is to me? Because right no. now my katana is a better weapon for me. Cameron currently yeah, has... I mean, somebody could just have an sword, extra. Right? That ice sword and the mirror shield. And she also has another dagger on her, on uh, in her inventory. So. so, Jeff, how would Shambles feel about the <laughs> magical dagger of wind? <laughs> Actually, um, uh, he's, he's got a... Shambles can have a dagger? He, Man, yeah. even he's, the he's minion a has a better weapon than yeah. that, Tommy. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I, I think... I think that... Katie, your wand is taken. <gasps> um, anyway, whatever. Trevor, no! <laughs> Trevor, do you have dual wielding at all? I don't, know. I'm focusing on two-handed. Oh, that's right, that's right, okay. Tommy, also... I think I'll just hold on to the dagger on my belt. Just in case I get disarmed or something. Okay. There are 300 gold pieces in here as well. Ooh. Now we're talking. That's 60 a piece. Uh, uh, 
You have 60 gold apiece to everybody then. And that is uh, everything yeah. else. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. This is Sexy. an awesome answer. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Yes. What were the stats on the dagger again? Regular 1d4 plus what? Two plus wind damage. two wind damage. I've never made a wind element. Thing before, but now it's all specified. <laughs> now so it's all specified. That just sounds ow. Maybe get do you get whiplash or like? Yeah, you you stab somebody and they feel a breeze That's inside of their wound. Like a tornado. <laughs> kind of like Say like you stab them and they just slowly inflate Aunt Marge style. Ah, Harry Potter reference. <laughs> Bam. Well, it kind of made me think of. That's uh, one. That made me think of Cloverfield. <laughs> we have to get to seven before the end of the night. That's one. <laughs> there you go. Challenge all okay. right. Okay. There you go. Now, moving on. You guys are still in the room. Do you rest? Do you proceed onto the room across the way that you entered? Or there's a door to the right as well? I, I'm i going to say that I don't want to rest. But if other people do need to rest, I can keep a watch. Especially with all my minions. But if we don't rest, then I could oh, say... I would like to go through the door to the right. Um, I don't need to rest. It's my vote. I'm fine. I, I say continue. On the Gila. Do you need to rest? Wait. Nope. I guess we're good. Here's a question for you, Jeff. If you all slept, could you turn to Sean and say, hey, let me know if something's coming, and then he'd be all like... No, 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 it's mindless. It's mindless? Yeah. Oh, Sean. That's right. <laughs> what about Shadies? Could Shadies be all like... All the minions are... Uh, arguably, all the minions are, are basically mindless without my... Um, Dictation. Consciousness right. being aware of, of, of the surroundings. Okay. Why so. don't you give yourself, like, a disadvantage? Why don't you go, yeah, they're super Oh, yeah, dude. My minions are the fucking smartest. <laughs> Born from the earth. Huge brain. <laughs> Huge brain. You got mud brain. You just... <laughs> Alright. So we have one mud vote to the door to the right. Uh... Yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Well, yeah. ladies... Door to where Huh? Door to the right or left? Uh, Hold on. Wait, how many votes do we have on the left one? Left. Zero. How left. All right. Die That's a perfectly reasonable <laughs> reason to use. I the can either do a Jeff? die break. I can do a die break yeah. and see which one you guys Elitist go down, or you guys can split. Uh, at, least, at least I have a reason for going to the right. What's your reason? Because every time you go into a dungeon, you always follow the right. Oh, because it's the right way. I get it. Okay, I'll go yeah. right. <laughs> Left. Your fingers make an L, and it's really cool. She's got a point. Go right She's got a really good point. Wrong way. <laughs> oh, Lord. We can only go the right way, guys. Yeah. But I want to go the left way. You mean the wrong way. No. Fuck. <laughs> Every time I laugh, all you can see is my hair shaking. All right. You guys make it through the right doorway, and you find yourself in a long hall that stretches to the left. Hmm. You also find another door immediately, no, not immediately, like about 10 feet off in front of you, also leading to the right, like to another part of the fortress. Right. But to your left is a long hall. And down that long hall, you can see also it bends out of sight to the left. Mm -hmm. And all throughout this hall is a bunch of beds. It's a bunch of mats and places for people to sleep. There are... That's a hallway, so it's a, like a really wide hall? Yes. Okay. Yes. There are, within sight right now, there's only one person, and he is currently asleep. Huh. I want to roll for sneak. What okay. is he? What he is they're it? all human. Hey. Yeah. Uh, he's also fucking Natural dead. Natural goddamn 20. You perfectly hide. You should death it's sentence not, the guy that's sleeping. It's not that hard because he's, you know, asleep. <laughs> Please do. Just do it. Um, so, Tommy, I want to sneak up oh so stealthily with my dice roll. Up to the dude who's sleeping. Okay. Oh, God. And, uh, I want to do a quick check on him. You know, I'm looking for garb. I'm looking for weapons. I'm looking for, I don't know, anything that might jump out at me about this guy. He is, you know how in the hierarchy of clothing on this game, there's, like, cloth, padded, etc., etc.? He is yeah. not even cloth. Like, he is, like, in shambles. 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 <laughs> that I hear the, I heard the hesitation. Now. Um, there is, inside my minion. There is, like, rags on him. He's not wearing any protection at all. Oh, he'll die fast. But, but, <laughs> but... Did you give me a d20 for this inspection? No. Go ahead. Uh, 11 plus my cunning is 17. You can see that he is very sick. Oh, no. Kill him. Mrs. I mean... Uh, 
Even though his cloth is poor, <laughs> is it like the same stuff that the other ones were wearing? Like, is he blatantly part of the same crew? It's not blatant, but you can kind of assume mm. because he's so deep in here, but it's not a promise. Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, now that changes things a little bit. Kill him faster. <laughs> just make it quick and painless. I mean, I have a wig dagger. I wonder what it would do in somebody's eye. Oh, God. Uh, I don't know. I almost kind of want to wake this guy up and interrogate him. What do you guys think? That probably would work, actually. You do what you want. Sure. Uh, You're I sneaking up to this guy. The, uh, the other three are all standing back by the no door. No part of this. You go, man. You, you <laughs> got this. You got this, man. We uh, believe in you. The door's right here. We're going to just go, okay? We're going to go. <laughs> um, okay, so here's what I do. I go out of stealth. I pull out my new dagger. And I hold it to the schmuck's throat, like, super gently, like, not even really putting pressure. Okay. And then I make a loud noise to wake him up. And then he wakes up and he moves his head into the knife and dies. <laughs> I didn't think of that. Yeah, I'll be moving the dagger so he doesn't accidentally cut his own body. Thank you. <laughs> that was a tactical error on my part. I'm going to give a creative flavor to the dagger. It has one of those swervy blades, like a wave. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, yeah. Um, he wakes up very, very groggy. Um, it's almost like he has only been asleep for like 30 minutes. Like that deep, uncomfortable sleep to be woken out of. Okay. Yeah. And he, when he sees you, he like can barely focus on you, but nothing on his face portrays any sort of yeah. hostility. I just anyway. realized wearing a Digimon shirt, by the way. Digimon. Digimon. I'm wearing Gomamon. I like Gomamon. Gomamon, man. Agumon, great. Guys. I didn't like the shirt. Moms. The shirt for Agumon, though, looked really weird, honestly, so we didn't get it. That's fair. Like anyway, anyway. Um, I want to start asking him about this castle in general. Like, hey, buddy. <laughs> All I want to know whose castle is this? Who runs the chain? Honest truth is that he can barely stay awake while you're asking him a question. Uh -oh. So even if he's like, Starting to talk, he starts to drift off. Hmm. But you you do not see. It's not like he's unwilling to answer. It's like, oh, this is the the. Uh. You just exhausted. Yeah. <laughs> it's at this point that my character walks up to Phobos casually. You are approached casually. casually. <laughs> oh man, I wish I had my piss. I could just throw it on and wake him up. Like, mm. yes. <laughs> I'll never Yo. forget it. So, I hold out my hand to try and feel any magical presences coming from this sick man with a 16 plus 10. 12. 12. There is something ancient and feral inside of his bones, but he is not a threat at this current time. Hmm. I don't like when you say Zero, not a threat at this time. Current I, don't, time. Yeah, I don't like that either. That, Can that I... sounds foreboding. Hmm. Uh, hey, yes, darling. <laughs> Ew. I want to take one of my silver arrowheads and kind of wave it in front of his face so nobody can smell it. That's. Oh. It smells metallic. Give me a D20. <laughs> Keep shoving it up his nose, I guess. Yep. 18. Alright, you're fine. He perks up a little bit in like in his presence. He's like, what he says is, "Don't hurt me." So focus, laddie, and I wanna have to. <gasps> mean. He's kind of a. He's eliciting a <laughs> mixture of grunts and moans and grimaces. Are you a werewolf? Not right now. <gasps> oh. Are there werewolves in this castle? Where do you think you are? That's what I'm looking to find out, lad. Oh, oh. Hmm. Uh, as he does that, I kind of lightly backhand to try and keep him focused. He lets out a curse and says, What? What? I clearly That's can't do anything right now. Why is the talent? Just need you to focus, laddie, and we'll go away and leave you be. He rolls over, kind of pissed off. He rolls away from you, and you see, like, injury marks on his back. 
and you see that they are emitting a ear, like an eerie silver light out, out of the injury. I'm going to go full asshole for a moment, and I'm going to Focus. touch yeah. the silver arrowhead to the wounds. <gasps> That's so mean! I smack his hand away. You're so adored. With a seven. My Trevor and roll resistance. Sensitive to this stuff. My defense is 12. Unlike my old character. Uh, 13 plus whatever. He does it before you can reach him. I zap him then. Ooh. Oh, jeez. She gonna zap him. I zapped him with a one, though. You zapped him. Mm -hmm. You zapped him after the fact. <laughs> and so while he is letting out a ah from the zap, the guy lets out a howl. Literally a howl. As long as the zap doesn't go like through him and into the arrow and like metal. <laughs> <laughs> the silver thing I can't remember. <laughs> the man uh, loses consciousness from the pain. God damn it, Bobos. Ar around the corner, down the hall, you see two more men, like, half walking, half crawling, around the corner looking at what where the howl came from. And when they see you, their eyes widen and they try to, like, hide back around the corner. My character looks at Phobos and says, he's, he's clearly suffering, just kill him. <gasps> You're a psychopath, you know that? <laughs> not to mention the fact that we were hired to hunt werewolves. Actually, you know what? I'm not. I'm sorry. You're not a psychopath because you can feel now. You're a sociopath. Thank you. There you go. I've been watching Sherlock. Don't mind me. Trevor. <laughs> Trevor. The silver in his back seems to explode like there was some sort of combustible f um, substance inside of him. And when you mm -hmm. pierced him with another source of silver, it just seemed to explode inside of him. It's not gory, but it's just kind of like the silver reacted with the silver. It's, it's, I, I can't really think of another way to, to say it, but it's kind of like, it sounded, it sounds like metal shattering when it happens, and he's dead. Um, here's a question for all of you. Um, retroactive question, I guess. But as you've been going through this fortress, have you been killing people, or have you been knocking them out? I've been knocking them out. Okay. I stabbed the dude through the head. True. <laughs> I'm mostly just jabbing at people because yeah, I'm a Not to put too fine a point on it, but through the goddamn head. <laughs> so I guess it kind of depends on who has been ending each person. Yeah. yeah. Ending. Okay. okay, that's fair. My, my character hasn't been careful to not kill them. Okay. Trevor, you gain 75 XP. Da -na 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 -na. What else does the party do? I literally look at Phobos and I say, good job. You, you gain five XP for being a malicious son of a bitch. Sweet. <laughs> I'm writing it down. Don't you stop me. I'm not gonna stop you. <laughs> <laughs> Katie, you gain ten XP for zapping Trevor. Yeah. Uh, Trevor, take zap damage. Oh, yeah. God damn it. Yeah, we'll zap uh, twelve. Twelve. <laughs> 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 No, you're not. You're not that sorry. I'm not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's a zap of love. <laughs> Alright. The zap of humanity. <laughs> hey, Jenny. I could use Thanks for having me, Trevor. Hey, Jenny. I could use some healing. <laughs> <laughs> um, did everybody in the party see the other two dudes come into the room in the Trine Veil? Yes. Yes. I hopped after them. Jinxa goes after them and quickly catches up with them because they also abuse, ah, blah, 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 seem to be very injured. Mm. I follow um, Jinxa. Jinxa, what do you do? I follow as well, just for record. Well, I asked ask one of them or both of them, how many of you are there? Um, one of them seems outright not willing to talk to you whatsoever and keeps trying to crawl, run away. The other one, seeming to think, like, oh, a diplomatic approach, thank God, he turns to you and says, 18, but most of us are not here right now. Where are the others? Come to think of it, I don't know. I've been here for a few days. Uh, why are you injured? What I, happened? I don't want to talk about it. Why? Yes, Trevor? I want to stop the dude who's trying to leave from leaving while Jinx talks to the other guy. Okay. Like, something okay. as simple as stepping on his back and just kind of standing. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was thinking, like, of hopping onto his back. Yeah, head. just while you do your thing, just be like, I need to stay here if I need one of you. He, can, 
he cannot resist your weight. Oh, oh, oh baby. He, he says, we fought a great enemy and we lost, okay? It is taking great tolls on our pride. You, don't, you need not open this wound. We already have wounds on our back. Who are you fighting? <gasps> no. You got it. Why? I'm so the lady, lassie, sorry, lassie. I'm not that second furry. <laughs> he says, the gray one. Could I ask some details here? No. Why? I slowly pass one of my silver arrows to Jinx up. He says, if you are going to kill me, then I will die with pride, because I will not give a, I will not speak that monster's name. Could you write it down? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's reference number two, because today's the Harry Potter thing, because it's episode seven, so I'm referencing Harry Potter tonight, so we have to make seven references to Harry Potter. That's number two, because Harry says that to Hagrid in book one. Would you write it down? It might have even come out ten years ago. I did not know that. That's wow, that's a very, very specific quote from the original book. And she didn't even mean to well do done. it. But anyway, reference number two. He says, <clears throat> I don't know how to write. That's unfortunate. What kind of pe people are you? Simon X. We're oh, animals. What do you think we are? What are you all doing in one place? We are all home with our pack. Who's the alpha? <laughs> Your mother. Oh! Sorry. <laughs> he sort of thinks about it, like kind of has shifty eyes, and he's like, "I guess it kind of depends, actually." There's the goddess that guards us, and there's like the pack leader that died a long time ago, but is currently trying to be resurrected. I have just said too much. <laughs> you really have, sir. <laughs> it's Thanks, okay, bro. though. Kill me now. I can't live with this shame. You uh, could say that he just looked up and said, I shouldn't have told you that. Or you Reference can, number three. Or you could try to be a good I person. should not have said that. You could they, be they you could be a good person and, uh, and, and friendship and love and magic. Is it a full moon It's right not now? my little pony. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's Harry Potter. <laughs> Silverback. Katie. It's Silverback Sparkle. <laughs> Katie's showing off the fact that she has no idea what Harry Potter is. All right, so go on. Go on and try is it a full moon? Say it's not so Was no. it a full moon last My rules suck today. Why are they... So the diary that you guys found back in the dining room, or in the VR guest room, as you said last session, um, the diary said that there has not yet been a full moon since the pack felt the, the unnatural desire to come back to this place. They have not changed for over a decade. And so all of a sudden they feel like they need to come back here, but there has not been a full moon, so they don't know if it's because they suddenly are going to change again, or what. Do they? So they don't shift at all? They just stay in human form? They, or? Ha they have not for over a decade, but back when they did, they did change form completely. Okay. So these... Do they smell each other out? Then they know they have a, they have a natural connection to each other. <laughs> okay. Through pheromone, through magic, through okay. the goddess, through whatever you want to say. That's just why I'm wondering, like, how is this group of people essentially find each other? When They're connected it's... through the same source of power. Okay. Yeah. Gender. What kind of werewolf are we dealing with? <laughs> That's mostly it. Yes, Trevor. Yeah. Oh. Um, when they change, is it voluntary or is it something that happens to them? Is there a cure? It is not voluntary. Not voluntary. Got it. What was your question again? I'm sorry. It was the question about whether they change voluntarily or not, but they, they don't. It's completely involuntary. Is, is cool. there a cure? And so whatever triggers them has not triggered them for 10 Triggered. Years. Yes. Wow. All right. Um, they do not know of a cure because their power was kind of... It, it's the same kind of traditional, like, you have to be bitten or scratched by a werewolf to get the chance of getting the curse. Oh. Um, and then after they changed for the first time, they had this connection. He's willing to tell you all of this. He, there, they have a connection with Palma and Palma tells them, despite what people tell you, you are not a monster. You have every right to exist as humans do. And so they don't feel like they need a curse because they have a family here. Hold on, Charlie. Are, are they actually hurting anybody? That's my question. Like, yeah, I was gonna say, where did this quest come from? Yes, that's so. That's a good point. And, and I want to point out, 
um, the goblin camp, where we snuck up upon six goblins roasting food. Like, yeah, that was a good fight. yeah. Um, they they had uh, a depiction of Poma in the camp, and I'm wondering if the goblins or the pregnant wood elf is or has any connections with werewolves. Hmm. Or if the dragon is still pregnant or if, she give birth? Or if the um, yeah, dragon is specifically knocking up werewolf women. Boom. <laughs> no, <I don't> <laughs> werewolf dragon babies. Alright. That would be so cool. Were dragons. Ooh. They have they're having vampire dragons, so why not? Wergens. <laughs> Wergens. Oh I'm sorry, did I kick you? Oh um, I'm so sorry. He says, as far as hurting people goes, he says, we try not to. That's why our home is so deep in the forest. Hmm. Noting, noting an emphasis on try. There has been, there have been mistakes. Of course there have been, because people try to go out to town before we run out of supplies of something, the full moon hits, and oh shit, we're in the middle of dreamscape. But that hasn't happened in 20 years. Do you mind if I step on this interrogation, Cameron? Go for it. I want to get down close to the guy's face and be like, then laddie, somebody wants your hand on a pike. Why would they want that? Because we're a monster to them. We, I mean, you haven't seen us change probably because it's been so long, but we look <laughs> awesome. But no, Wait. we look scary. And so we inspire fear in stories. Of course people want us dead because they fear what people don't understand. Don't people feel the same way about tieflings, Phobos? I was going to say, I look up at my horns. <laughs> back down like, uh, you're not going to win many points with me for that one, boy. <laughs> but, 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 there are people who feel the same way about tieflings. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I fucking kill them, too. I mean, what? Ah, and that's the reason why. They are terrified of tieflings because we're all, of you, Phobos. We're all monks here. We all try to find balance within ourselves so that we don't lash out. They don't want to be evil. I do. Yeah. Well, that's clear. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and defer this question to the party instead of assuming. Okay. Like, I don't know. So I'm, we I'm can ask you and me. Guys. He, the man, mm. says, can you please get off my friend? No. Why are you so afraid of us? Uh, only because you said please, and I take my foot off the guy's back. <laughs> he answers Cameron's question of why are you afraid of us. He's like, because you just murdered that guy over there. C correction, I did not. <laughs> okay, I did. That you, me. you guys did. And based off the screaming that we heard in the other room, I'm pretty sure you've been doing in the other guys. I'm sorry, I tried to stop him. I tried. But my I'm zaps are not strong, strong enough yet. Late. Zap! <laughs> Look, the fact is, is that regardless of how you perceive us, damage has already been done on both sides. You guys already think that we're villainous because we're something unnatural, and we think you're villainous because you've already killed members of our pack. Actually, I was just hiding. I don't give a shit. Cool. <laughs> and he picks up his friend, and he they shuffle over to two beds, and he... Pops his friend down and he sits on one. He's like, I'm I'm I'm, he says, I'm done talking. Or not. Uh, before you're done talking. No. <laughs> do you know anything about the werewolves? Uh, oh, dear God. God. <laughs> <laughs> he says, seriously, I just, I just <laughs> I, I, said that. I just told you that. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of a movie. Yep, yep. 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 Yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Well, um, four. Well, I'm four. <laughs> well, going back to the task at hand, I, I do believe that the blue orb that shattered in the other room had something to do with the three harp-like devices, and <laughs> one of the colors of the three harps was blue, so that might have changed in some way. Or we need to bring the orb back not shattered, to the harp-like things. How are we supposed to unshatter it? No, no, I mean, I'm talking about for the, the, the future I hardly knew two her. orbs that might or may or may not be in this fortress. How do we unshatter something? Too late. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, 
Lots and lots of glue. <laughs> mustard is made from mustard seeds. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a Harry Potter reference. <laughs> Uh, but it's still a funny reference. Thank you. So, what does the party do? Oh, by the way, everybody take 200 XP for that delicious conversation. Yay! Good delicious. job, all of you. Oh, so tasty. Yummy. Just one. one in my What's mouth. everybody's level currently? Five. 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 Cool. Five. I caught up. Cameron, your level's five. Yeah. Well, um... Party choice. I, I say we continue... Uh, to the next room. Mm -hmm. I say I agree with you, so I apologize. Indeed. They want to make it to the, to the end of the hallway to see what's at the end. Okay. You find another doorway. I open it. You open the doorway, <laughs> and a bright red light hits your irises, Ugh. and you're just like, ow. Whoa. There's right. another tree in the center of this much smaller room, and there are, hold a moment. <laughs> there is one man standing inside. Yes. Can I stealth again? Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's like 28. Okay. You guys enter the smaller red room. Yes, Jeff. I perform a magic check on the man <laughs> in the room. He just starts rolling. You're like, oh, okay. Four plus 12, 16. Me too. Hmm. Me too. Five plus 12. A 13. Plus 13. I got a 17. Technically a 17 is what I mean. He is non-magical except for the same in the same way that the others were that you magically sent to the other room. No. The man hears you enter, turns around, and clangs his metal gauntlets together. Oh, and, he, shit. and he says, I think he wants to fat, guys. He wants to fat. I have Sean clang his earth and fists together and go. <laughs> he charges. I Damn. Charge. Holy shit. He has, battle. My goal. He has oh. battle initiation, but you can charge mm. right after him. Mm. I also do taunt. Balls. <laughs> he charges towards Zilfin, then changes for the bunny. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh! It's so fun taunting. Oh. Cameron, he hits you and misses. He hits wow. you for 18 damage. Also, Cameron, uh, Jenny healed you for 20 HP, and you okay. gained uh, 68 gold. So, just so you know. 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 20. Uh, yeah. Where was I in relation to where the dude was running? Because I was stealth. Could I be, like, next to him? You can't be now. He's pretty much, like, right on top of you. So he okay, did I was going to say, what I wanted to do was try and cut his ankles as he went by. 18, you said? 18. Okay. Yes. Uh, you can try on your turn, but she's about to go. Okay. Fair. Okay, nice. I'll take care of the gold later. Okay. Uh, charge. Fifteen. Hit. Woohoo. Woohoo. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-two, Jesus twenty-three. Christ. That's including your simple phrase? Oh, simple sorry. Simple plan. Twenty-four. Twenty-four. Okay. Trevor. Yo. Go. I want to steadily go right behind the guy. Swing it horizontal for his Achilles tendons. Okay. <gasps> We're gonna be sneaky, Charlie. Disabling strike. <laughs> that wasn't so great. Uh, one sec. Mm. Uh, that is all told of 15. <laughs> Miss. Yeah. Huh? Katie. Well <laughs> shot gets reductions to the head. Mm -hmm. Well, no. I'm going to. Well, first I have my shock aura. I'm gonna do that first. Uh, do I usually put do a d20 for shock aura? No. No. Okay. I it's a that. random target, though. Oh, that's right. That's I'm kidding. The I'm kidding. Target. There's only one I mean, target. Going well, on. yeah, but I mean, like, uh, I forgot target. I have to use my d4. First, is my thing. I have to read it again. Damage to random enemy every turn. 25% chance. Okay, I'll do this first. Am I supposed to call it out? If you don't call it out, it's a four. Oh, okay, then I gotta win. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so then um, he still does take damage though, right? Crap, why can't I remember how Shakura works? It is, mm. you roll, I think it's like a d12 or a d10. It's a d10 plus magic. Yeah, so it's d10. Oh, okay. Time. You should write that down. I thought I did. <laughs> I thought you did too. You should write that down. Shakura. <laughs> oh, I did. I just can't read my own handwriting. <laughs> oh, oh. I know that feel. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I, I did a. Um, 
15 damage with my shock aura. Ooh. And now I'm going to use fire on him. <gasps> <gasps> Never mind, I got a one. Oh, well, Jeffrey. <laughs> <Jeffrey. laughs> right, well, God damn Jeffrey. I have, um, I have Sean approach and punch the man in the face. Don't mind her. Not ah, heavens. <laughs> it was a 20 for a second. Oh, my lanta. Uh, for a second. Plus two is ten. Plus four is fourteen. Miss. Damn it. Um, my suddenly, um, Zilton is like. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so new to um, emotions. I don't I know have, how to show. I have uh, Shady's cast poison on him, uh, and it's successful, and uh, that would be a D four plus. So two. Plus five, seven poison damage. So I'll take another seven after his next turn. And then I have Shambles approach with his broadsword and swing wildly at him. Um, six plus two is eight, plus two is ten, which is a miss. Mm-hmm. Super duper. Yay. Uh, and then I have my character go, son of a bitch, and zap him. Son of a bitch. For twelve unholy damage. Jenny. Mm. I'm gonna go and use my sword on him to make you know the actual tit. Ting, ting. Oh, seven. What's your willpower? It's seven. Miss. <laughs> well, shit. Enemy phase. Wait a minute. Does anybody need healing? No, you don't. You're all good. We just started fighting. No, I actually do need healing. Okay. I have an instant <laughs> I use on you now. Yay. Flash heal your ass. Flash ass. Flash heal your ass. 17. You Cast. know what? Knowing Katie, that's probably where she's at, me. Cast. <laughs> 13, motherfucker. That's very accurate. Uh, motherfucker, I'm back to full health, motherfucker. Damn. What do you, you say? I said thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> We're gonna say, say five. You're welcome. Four. Nine. Katie, you were dealt 18 melee damage. Oh my heavens. What? So it is. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> yes, she taunts so and takes the 18. Yeah, I was wondering where oh. the warning was, Tom. Um, it's only 17 because you have damage reduction. Thank you, Cameron. Right. <laughs> I also have 14 defense. Does that make any difference here? Yes. Okay. It, it eventually but will it, when he misses you. I would, it, I would it, hope so. It missed you once, but he oh. hasn't missed you yet, since then. Aw, he missed me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Trevor, by the way, I saw Alien Covenant, and it's a good oh, yeah. thing you did not go to see that movie. Seven, and you probably should never. <laughs> was, was there another, time? like, um, abortion thing? He well, heals for 21 points. There's definitely a points. part where uh, you see Great. an alien come out of the guy's because back, of the red and you can light. see his spine come out. Ew! It's pretty bad. It's pretty gory. That's the most I'll go into detail. I'm sorry. Is <laughs> it good, though? I loved it. Yeah, I loved it a lot. It was so good. I will not repeat what I just said. I'm sorry. My character noticed that the gauntlet wearing motherfucker just heals for 21, which is considerable considering we haven't done much damage to him. That's a the problem. Source being from the red light. Uh, which is at the base of the tree, by the way. That's a problem. Yeah. Um, I have Simple Phrase activated. Mm-hmm. I hope everybody's mm-hmm. accounting for that. Yeah. But I also forgot that I have a new ability called Haunting Melody. Do those stack? No. no. One, no. one song can only be active at a time. Darn it. Oh, I didn't know that. I've never played a bard. Well, one's a phrase, one's a melody, you know. Like, exactly. <laughs> so, so I'm this. together. She I'll says, be a dual tone singer. <laughs> she, she shouts, balls to the wall, guys, and then sings Evanescence. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's pretty much the same thing, Jeff. Totally. All right, so, Cameron, it's your turn. Oh, okay, well then, I'm going to activate Haunting Melody. Now, do I get the MP back from Simple Phrase when I deactivate no. it? Okay, that's what I thought. So, I got Haunting Melody activated. How much damage is that going to do? By the um, way, uh, seven is... more poison damage from the man, oh, if uh, you forgot. It is 2d4 plus 2 true damage, end of every turn. Terrific. I don't know if that's everybody, or is that just No, it's, it's, it's just the enemies. just the enemies. Oh, okay. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 14. Okay. Um, that's going to keep happening. I'm going to turn my phone. Yeah, you better make it I'm quiet. Just, just be quiet. Sorry, Cody, I threw my dice at you, and they're under Katie. <laughs> oh, oh, the oh! The one I need. I think I just of found course. it. Yep. <laughs> I'm got gonna it. use my. 
uh, I'm gonna use my mirror shield. Mirror um, shield. It hasn't absorbed anything. It has no magical charges right now. Okay. Uh, in that case. Oh, yeah, I never wrote down anything. <laughs> right? So, so, right. so, so I will, It's kind of a moot thing mm-hmm. right now, but it's a. Um, so it increases <laughs> it your like defense by three. Okay. Really big and. Yeah. <laughs> that bunny got a big butt. Uh, mirror shield, mirror shield. Plus three defense requires eight strength. The two abilities are absorb and reflect, and it's kind of moot right now okay. because you have not That's absorbed it. anything, therefore you cannot reflect. Okay. Booper. I don't mm. think I've added my three defense, so... Then do so now. 14. Did you have the shield on before? She had her buckler on. Okay, so it's, it, it would just be like, what, one, one more. more? One more. Oh, okay. So I have to take the buckler off to do... Yes. Okay. So it'd be 15. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Um, shield forever. Shield bash every turn. Like a speed punching bag, just... Do I count Haunting Melody in that? Or no? no, it will at the end of the turn. So that's 19. At the end of player phase. Which one? 19. 19. Plus your simple phrase? Oh, your simple phrase is deactivated. I just deactivated. Yeah. All right. Trevor. I use Death Sentence. Done, done, done. Okay. Will that work on a boss, though? Oh, well, I mean, he's testing whether or not it is. Uh, True. I, mean, uh, I still, uh, uh, I'm I'm right. Yes. Six. Misses. I ate all the cherries out of it. It hits. Such a brat. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. Trevor, you always have to hit a nat 50 in order to work. Um, <laughs> deals no damage. So, Katie. Okay. My turn again. Unless Trevor wanted to do a minor action. Wait. Tell me, I think I fucked up. Yeah. What? When I, when I swung at the guy. Yeah. Originally and missed, did I lose stealth? No. Then never mind, I'm okay. Yeah. They whistled past his ear, but he didn't because, know where you were. <laughs> yeah, because you missed him, he did not detect you. Got it. Yeah. Just wanted to make sure that I wasn't cheating. <laughs> Let me uh, then, yeah, uh, no minor action, I'm good. All right. Shock aura first. Uh, 18 damage. Shot to the heart. And now, <laughs> I'm going to try that fire on him again. <laughs> A 19. Yeah. Is that a crit? Yes, it is. If you have five willpower. Uh, I have... Or, or spell... I have five whale power. Will, why, oh. Whale power. Whale power. Spell crit. Whale what is your spell crit damage? So would that be my max magic? Uh, your magic stat, one and a half times. So if it's 12, it'll be 18. Okay, so it's 1d4 plus magic burn damage. So that's a 4 plus my 12... Four plus eighteen, so twenty-two. Er, oh yeah. You did twenty-two burn damage. That's amazing. Damn. <laughs> yep. Jeff, we'll go with that. So it's gonna be forty-four damage overall. That's great. Jesus. Oh, Jeff. Now, um, my character is upset because of how much he missed <laughs> last turn. In rage mode. <laughs> He's like, Raw, super so bad. Right. <laughs> um, I have Sean. Double fist punch him. Sean. Uh, so. Sean. Oh shit! Simple phrase no longer active. Oh no! You're my boy. So. What does that do? Eleven. Again. It's plus two attack, plus one damage. Simple phrase. 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 Simple yeah. He's blowing bubbles. Um, Frustration. <laughs> I have uh, my skeletal warrior attack. Miss. Uh, actually, I think you're right. He did. He mm-hmm. did miss it. Um, well, shadies are the only useful one. Please do something. <laughs> three. Three. I'm going three, to, three. 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 I'm, I'm going to have shadies cast darkness on him for one turn, which is blind. Darkness. <laughs> <laughs> I cast darkness on him for one turn. Yeah. He's like, oh no, I can't hit you. Wait, yes, I can. Well, it's like a minus six, though. Cool. You know what, Tommy? You're a real jerk sometimes. I yeah, Tommy. Okay. 
Jeff, for... can I just say how sad I am that Sean is not one of your skeletons, so he's not Sean of the Dead? <laughs> Fuck you, Trevor. <laughs> sad, bro. Uh, Twelve, <laughs> 12 <laughs> unholy. <laughs> Jenny. <laughs> I will say this for Cameron's sake. She has been hit several times with heavy damage. Yes. I well, I, I do ask every time. Yes. What a mindful healer. And it's your turn. Okay. Oh, boy. A good healer should, I should know have given you damage, damage without asking. <laughs> That's <laughs> mean. Yeah. It's my first time being a healer. I know. I know. And, and this is why I'm telling you so this. So that next I want some taquitos. Well, I should have given you a shield, I guess, before. I've been taunting a lot. Oh, so. God! <laughs> Don't complain no more! <laughs> Any more? Come on, at least it's proper grammar. We're all no. Like, yeah, it's Sandlot, actually. But fine, Trevor. <laughs> do. do you have any status ailments, or is it just health? Just health. Just health. Okay. MP's ran low, but that's not a big deal for me, let's say. I wish I could heal you and give you mage armor. But I'll heal you first. Heal first, definitely. Um, no. 20! Wow. Strawberry. Damn. Yay. So that means she gets max, right? Um, plus. so max die roll amounts and plus magic and a half. So it's 2d. Two there you go. There you go. It's that hurt for the speaker's BT-dubs. <laughs> 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 oh, my magic's an odd number. What is it? 13. 13, yeah, so it'll be 7, so it'll be 20. 20. 13 cut in half, rounded up is 7. So, okay. 7 plus 13. 20. Yeah. Sorry. Hey, numbers. Okay. 13, 13, 13. It's 21 plus 7, then. 28. 21 plus... Alright, you're killed for 28. Woo! That was Do you need nice more? Math, Jenny. That, was a, uh, that was a heal. Let me find out. Because I cannot math that fast. I do no. numbers. I'm horrible. I'm, I'm a, like a math math math. Um, I still have 8 damage on me, but that's not a big deal. I have 58 HP, so I'm okay. okay. You literally have 20 more HP than I do, Cameron. Okay. Sweet. As she should. I am tank. Uh, Alright. I am the tard. What? <laughs> I'm so happy that you've just taken that and run with it, by the way. It's hilarious to me. <laughs> Alright. Like you, I embrace you. Help me. Why not? No one cares about the red orb. Uh, roll. <gasps> uh, haunting. Right, your roll haunting ability. Okay. Oh, and he's also. I'm just gonna do the 22 burn damage right now, okay? Thank you. Four plus four. Eight, nine, ten. He's got ten damage. Did you remember to? Oh, that was that was Okay. Yes. <laughs> to answer that, yes. 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 <laughs> if there was a question in there. Yes. He is healed for twenty six from the, from the scarlet light. Super. He bellows, hey. and hey. says something very mean. And he and he Fuck. has a little tantrum where he stomps the ground several times. And then does a double hammer fist onto Cameron. That's not nice. I use my shield and absorb. <laughs> can only absorb magical energy. Not, am, not the impact? Nope. I mean, uh, you're, the impact is from the plus three defense that it gives you. Oh, uh, okay. Maybe I Which, what's your defense right now? Four, five. Um, 15. 15. 15. He rolled a 17. Super. Yes. So considering even with his subtraction from the blind, he still hits you barely. Okay. Barely. Well, how much am I taking here? It is. It's no squeak. Two. It's, it's 36. <laughs> okay. And his turn is over. I'm still up, so I'm cool. fine. His turn is over, and he looks very exhausted. It is player phase. Good. Somebody go for that damn light. It is your turn. <laughs> okay, well, um, I've got him on top of me at Keep this on, point. Bro. So, yeah. It's really funny. <laughs> she, she gets hit. Go for the light. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody get that damn light. Uh, when you silence funny. somebody with the lightning ability, does silence. that mean I, if I would silence him from doing anything for a moment? For, for anything for from that costs MP. Yes. I only have 14 MP left, Jenny. Please. Oh, wow. 
out of my 58. How did that happen? I thought you said it only hit her barely. Did it hit her twice? It was, yeah. No, it was a, it was a, du- it was a double fist attack yeah. at once, so... I'm, I'm guessing my fists. feet kind of went like, down into the ground a bit. <laughs> and Bree's like... <laughs> he's like, I'm Rocket and he's my group? Yeah, kind of thing. he's your group. Can I flash who her now? Or do I wait for Yes, you can. Oh, okay. I can flash awesome. you now. Cool. It's uh, 13 magic. Wait, oh. wait, wait. Roll. Uh, I'm going to roll my ice sword. This is the weirdest well. thing. Nine. So I click it. 13. And it doesn't actually come out. Maybe it should Well, now it is. Wait, then my turn next turn. (laughs) (laughs) You can't get it to work, man. It just won't work. No matter how many times. Uh, Trevor's not. Never had that problem. Anyway. um, I missed that. It's like a baby's forearm. It's like a baby's all molded an apple. Okay, three... I'm just right here. That's cool. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm like Grants, like can't. Amy Grants. I'm like, like, <laughs> I just can't. I also can't. <laughs> That's nine damage. Okay. Oh wait, hold on. Nine. Nine. Um, I'm sorry, but jumping from nine to nineteen is a big I forgot jump. the other two I need things. you. I need you to show your work on your own. Trevor, it's your turn. Like that. I'm about to be killed. <laughs> God, I did too. I'm just choking. Just... My brain didn't work like that. So I'm not directly fighting this guy because I just death sentenced him, huh? Yes. He now knows where you are. He's like, hey. And you're like, huh. <laughs> and I'm like, see ya. And I'm running for the orb. Yay. D20. Mm. What's your dex? What? What's your dex? Five, so eight. You make it to the orb. Woohoo! I stab it. D20. Get a 20, Trevor. I did. <gasps> I bring it up. Wait, let's see. If I can... <laughs> oh my god, he got a 20! Yeah, I see it. Oh! It says third 20 tonight. Oh. Nice. <laughs> you pierce it like it is a, f- a fresh heart. It is that easy to cut through, like, like butter, actually. And the moment that it is pierced, the red light seems to explode, and you guys are plunged into darkness. I shot Sony, my bad, everyone. Katie, your turn. I, uh, who turned out the light? a ma- mage, mage light. A mage light. Oh, mage. I'm gonna mage roll light. to see how powerful. I'm on mage light. I'm gonna see how mage powerful light. it is. A 20. <laughs> Super. Thanks, you Trevor, create a for light that, that was even brighter than the red light. Yeah. Illuminating the entire room, and nobody receives a minus to attack rolls now. Yeah. That was a minor action. What is your main action? <gasps> now, um, does he take another 22 burn damage? Yeah, I already applied that. Oh, okay, cool. So now, well, first, my aura. Where is the, oh. the dice? Which one is it? The dice. Oh, it's this one. Where is the dice? Uh, uh, 20 I say, I say. damage. He is dead. Oh, okay. Super. <laughs> you guys gained 300 XP. Oh, uh, even super He is dead. Asshole. Eight. I'm glad I'm dead. Death oh my god, 300? He would have died this turn anyway. Yeah, I wanted to see how that worked anyway. I was excited for that. Dude. Well, next time. Basically, after two turns, Jenny, they just dropped dead. Uh, Trevor, well, think yes, of it this way. I wanted to watch it carry out. <laughs> I should say. Oh, yeah, you... Within the game. You ensured that he up. would die if one of us didn't it's kill him at least. That was the fail safe. Okay, that. Exactly. <laughs> so annoying. Just level up. To level six? To level third. Wait, you, to level you, shut how, how did you level, Jeff? Because I keep track of my XP. You guys are all forgetful. <laughs> I, do, I keep track of my XP. Who doesn't? Guys, great. guys, now you're getting a little keep smart. track. He went through his loyalty mission. He's ahead of you by like 500 XP. Oh, no. At I least. haven't been here every turn, so like, why am I complaining? I get that part. And Katie's also been late to by two sessions, so it's okay. You guys will mm-hmm. catch up I someday. Maybe not. This. I don't know. I like that, Jeff. 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 Keep track of right. XP. Oh, what, 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 what? Shit. What? What's your actual number for XP? 7,005. Okay, hell, dude, he's 2,000. The doodle book. Oh, yeah, I remember that thing. How was that possible? Oh. It was supposed to be your character. That's a, <laughs> that's a big difference. <laughs> Happy. That's a big difference. 
Did I miss I something? Love the, oh. yeah, I feel like <laughs> I you, love finding like my old school. I feel books. like you missed something, but that, that, that doesn't make I'm any sense. I'm not nearly the same level, but you know. Oh, shit. <laughs> I think you're still good. What? Oh, okay. How I lost my fucking save file? Like I didn't have Red's cloak or anything? Yeah. Oh, that's probably weird. I lost all the XP gains from that session, too. The what end. are you thinking? That's Well, that would make sense. So here's what I'm going give, <laughs> to give to you, Trevor. Uh-oh. A that, big middle finger. Is it rated G? <laughs> that session that you missed... You guys yeah. can you can subscribe to the channel and you can listen to the, <laughs> to that whole session. Thank, thank you, Tommy. And count up the XP oh, that oh, you missed. And make thank sure you. to like the video. Yeah, Comment Katie. And subscribe. And like share the it, video. Share it on your Tumblr <laughs> sure. and your Twitter. Yep. <laughs> and your Facebook. Oh my good God! You all now have a dead large monk in front of you, and the red crystal turned to dust as soon as it was pierced. I loot his body. His body has very large metal boots. That is the thing that guarded him from getting Achilles' heel pierced from Trevor. And uh, two large metal gauntlets that he wore that can be worn for um, plus one defense, but you have to have at least five strength to wield them. Sorry. And Mm. that counts as a shield, by the way, so you cannot have a shield and the gauntlets on at the same time. What? Damn. Tommy. Yes. And you have the gauntlets and wield the weapon? Yes. Would anybody object if I took those then? Go for it. Have at it, friend. <laughs> cool. I don't know, they seem useful for oh, me. Oh shit. No, Tommy. Why? I have bracers. Do those conflict? Yes. And never mind. What did the uh, gauntlets provide the wearer again? Plus one defense. Exactly the same as the bracers. Yeah. Yeah. So, but they will look so cooler than the bracers. You also find a pendant on him. Ooh, what to do? You find a pendant of Tomias. <gasps> do we know what it does? You can magic sense. Doing it. Seven plus Seven. twelve. Plus twelve. Here's what it does. It grants plus one to constitution. That's health. Yes. So Cameron should have it. I agree. Mm-hmm. It I is a pendant know. of Tomias. But I already have an amulet of Avalor. What, is that what does that one do? Too? No. What does the amulet one do? It increases her willpower by one. The amulet of mm-hmm. Tomias increases constitution by one. It's up to you. Which wouldn't move your health up if you did the... Could, uh, I, um, could I take the willpower one? Yeah. That'd be super. Go for it. So I'll give him the amulet. Ricky Necromancer has the Princess Sophia thing. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. How do I spell that? Am- a- amu- amulet? A-M-U-L-E-T of Avalor. A-V-A-L-O-R. Oh. Plus one willpower. Super duper. I've got one to boost my cunning. So what was the other one? Plus one constitution. What's the, what was the name of it though? Oh. What was the name of the time? Amulet of Tomias. Yes. Amulet of Tomias. Tomias. It's like Tobias or Tom. Tobias. Tobias. I always say Tobias. Tobias. I like Tobias. it better. Tobias. Tobias. Yes, quite Tobias. Tobias. Tobias, Lou. Yes. Oh. Poor kid. That, that comes from reading the um, Animorphs. Yeah. And never oh my god. They... The name. So I, there's an actual it word for that. I don't know what it is, but like, there's a word to describe when you have read a word, and so you know its definition in totally context and everything, but you don't know how to pronounce it correctly. And for the life of me, I cannot remember what that word is. I think I know the word you're talking about, and I don't remember it either. <laughs> so, do you guys go through the door on the other side of the room? Can I, like, put my ear to it and try to listen through first? Yes. Uh, rolled an 18 plus whatever the hell. You hear nothing. Can I try to look inside it with my special inside things anything? powers? You already used it. It's still the same day? Yes. Yeah. How long do days last? You guys have only been here for, been in here for, like, an hour. Yeah. Game Even though it's been a week since we last played, the time in the game didn't progress. Okay. All right, moving on. Um, my brain! All right. Do you go through? Uh, yeah, but can I stealth first? Yes. Woohoo! Another 18, plus a shitload. Every time he does that, it sounds like Casey Jr. It sounds like Homer Simpson to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Woohoo! Woo-hoo! Um, I agree. 
As you enter the, the new room, you find it is not a new room. You are back in the same chamber with the white focus crystal. Or sorry, blue focus crystal, not white. Oh, we, we, we did a roundabout. Yes. Got it. Focus your uh, I don't suppose the blue crystal has, like, come back or anything, has Re Regenerated? No, it has not. Alright. Okay. Um, so out of the room with the red crystal... Was there another entrance that we didn't go through? No. Um, so when you first entered this specific room, the blue crystal room, right. there's the way that you came. There was the door across the way, which is now where you are standing. And there was the way that you that you did go, which was to the right, that led to the bedrooms. However, when you guys got into the bedrooms, I said there was a door almost immediately in front of you leading elsewhere. But you guys went left along the actual bedroom area. And we looped around. Yes. I report my findings to the rest of the crew and suggest that we go through the other door in the oh. bedroom. Okay, William Shatton. <laughs> oh, right there. Trevor, um, Trevor draws another map like she like he did for the island long ago and then shows Katie. I drew a picture. <laughs> and Katie says, <laughs> I have a keyblade. <laughs> I have a keyblade. <laughs> we have an army. <laughs> we have a Hulk. Um, we have a Kroger. Do oh, you have a Kroger? Do you guys make your way back through the bedrooms to the door that you have not gone through? As we go through the bedrooms, am I still stealthed? Yes. So you're going to be fine in the Just to be a dick. I love how that question comes up all the time. Am I still stealth? You're a creeper who stealths through people's bedrooms. <laughs> what do you want to do to the guys? I want to just go through like, and then stealth again and sleep. You do that. <laughs> Both of them wake up and go, ah! And they hate you a little bit more. Oh my god. Super. You are no longer stealthed. How dare you disturb I these poor for people? Again, if I may. Okay. Eight plus eleven. You are re stealthed. Woohoo! I hate this game sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Reminds me of when I played as Eli. I disengage. From Jesus what? Christ, did you have like plus 20 something to stealth? Yeah. Yeah, it was something <laughs> stupidly <laughs> broken. Yeah, Eli uh, was. Eli was an assassin before the assassin nerf. <laughs> <laughs> it, it is. He is the one of the reasons why it happened. Yeah. You guys enter a bit of a short hallway, on. and or it's going to be about 20 yards long. Hmm. It's quite narrow. No one is in the room, or no one's in the hall. There's a door at the end. I'll start meandering slowly towards it, since I am all stealthified and whatnot. Probably won't get jumped at. Right. Yeah. yeah. Play scouty scout. Trevor, D20. Does this get any bonuses? Cunning. Then 20, but not a nat 20. You see a tile in the middle of the floor that has a pressure plate. Um, I... Go out of stealth and kind of do the whole. Yeah. <laughs> and point out the pressure plate so that everybody can see it very clearly and know not to step on it. Everyone is now aware of the pressure plate in the middle of the hallway. Uh, do I have? Would I have any knowledge of how to dis uh, disarm any such device? No. Well, shit. I recommend that uh, we. <gasps> Will I? Run. <laughs> no. Dang it. Am I alive? Dang it. No. <laughs> Excellent. But she's a bunny. I wear like nothing. <laughs> I, did, I did not say it took up the entire floor. I just said that it was a pressure plate. We should have one of your uh, your minions step on it. About a square foot. I have that Joe staff. Can I like reach out and push Joe's it into the floor? Oh my. You can. Huh? Yes, Five. you can. How long is Joe's staff? Five feet long. Find a rock. I'm going to do that. I'm going to mm -hmm. everybody to go back as far as they can. And I just... Makes me think of that movie, The, the Cube, I think it was called. Keep in mind, Phobos is as tall as I am, so that's a hell of a lot of reach. Okay. And do I need to roll for that? Yeah. Uh, six. I don't know what bonuses that gets, though. It very easily slides back into the ground as small little cross bolts start coming out of the walls by your feet. Everyone takes ten true damage. Shit. Shoot. It was like the whole freaking hall had uh -huh. Fuck. Sorry, guys. Damn it. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> I can't reduce I it with my fairy. Damage. Damage. Do you proceed? 
How much damage was that? Gingerly. Ten. <laughs> but you have damage reduction. Actually, no, it's true damage, so there's no deductions for that. Yep. Um, can I get healed? Oh, yeah. God damn it. That, that perfectly killed my golem. <gasps> Should I wait until my turn? Good job, Trevor. You're not in battle, so you can just do it freely. Nobody said not to do it. I need supervision. This is true. This is true. I just want to say, I, I don't think I'm going to be able to re-summon my golem in this area because it's have? all... Uh, it's not it's not earthen I in here. I have 40 damage out of 50. Oh, no. It's all like like like, like stone flooring okay. and stuff like that. I'm so I, I, I now. Okay. Well, I better not assume. Would or I be able to re-summon my golem? Inside of the fortress. I hold the ceremony for his golem with a 17. Nope. Okay. 27 damage. Okay. You guys make it to the end of the hallway. Do you do you open the door now, or do you guys want to rest or do something else here? Rest. Well, I think we need to rest. Rest. Okay. How long? Is there a safe place to rest? This hall is incredibly straightforward. But I'm bummed. Um, mm. Anything, anything restful that you do, you are basically sandwiched in between two rooms. That one you don't know, one you do. Keep in mind, the room behind you is filled with beds. <laughs> I was gonna say, and two dudes sleeping in them. Mm. They might not mind. <laughs> Happy Pride. They are around the corner from where you would be if you immediately enter the bedroom hall. I crawl into one of the beds with one of the dudes and go scoot over. <laughs> well, I'm gonna do there's, it. There's a lot of beds though. With right a seven. <laughs> you, talk, All of them. you talk to the one that Trevor stepped on and he's asleep. <laughs> so you whisper to him, he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> Hi, pretty Jane. <laughs> <laughs> My pink hair smothers him and he dies. The one who you guys were interrogating before, so the one that was not stepped on, he looks over, he's like, oh man. <laughs> No, just let Shambles watch. Um, how long do you guys want to wa- want to sleep? Um, long enough uh, for the heels to. Heal. I don't sleep. And uh, I want my MP. Jeff here. refuses to sleep. Then I will. Well done. Cool. Yeah, I heal too. Or how MP. many hours are we talking, guys? However uh, many I need to heal no. back to Four thirty-six good. health. Eight. Oops, I did that. To one. perfection. Full. Okay. If possible. Dang. It's a long time. It's eight hours. <gasps> hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Don't look. <laughs> I can't read that anyway, dude. Oh, I didn't know you were so blind. Upon the eighth hour, you all hear something that Jeff is telling me to not do. He's yes. gonna message you, that's about like Does that mean that we uh, don't heal all the way? You all heal to full. Oh, okay. Yay. Wonderful. <laughs> Bye, Trevor. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Two seconds. Is uh, Haunting Melody again, is that a always on? It is sustained. Okay. Oh, shit. Does that mean that the sleeping guys have been... Okay. They're, okay. They're, they're, they're not marked as enemies to her. No, fucking kill them. Wait, what? <laughs> they all get shock or in bed. <laughs> uh... You guys awaken after eight hours of sleep to find the two werewolves that... One of them, Jenny was... Or not Jenny, Katie was spooning. <laughs> the two of them are dead. Not Katie, the werewolf. Better not be me. Totally jump up and shout, I didn't do it, it wasn't me, don't fucking point me fingers. I zapped Trevor, no, I'm just kidding. I do. <laughs> uh, Jinxa gives him the dirty look, like, he, I, I'm watching you, kind of. Who? Thing. Trevor. Oh, Trevor. <laughs> Every, everybody's <laughs> suspecting the drunk tiefling, I guess. <laughs> Who hasn't drunk much. anything the entire game. <laughs> Can I roll to see if I have an idea of who it might actually be? Yes. <laughs> it's like we're playing an Clue eight. all of a sudden. Plus 12. So I know. You know who did it. I don't say anything, but I do give him a glare. Okay. In the drawer. <laughs> like a cotton wool <laughs> what do you guys do? God damn it. I loot the bodies. Rags. 
Don't want them. Silver injuries along the back, just like the first guy. Don't want those either. Do I Don't know? want those either. <laughs> <laughs> Does Jinxa notice anything to kind of figure out who, how, what happened or who did it? <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> she I'll has a crit. That. She has a crit. No, um, there's really nothing for you guys to loot here. They're already dead, so you can't really do anything about it. And Jeff I'm already. Jeff in already has his two bony man. bones, so he can't really like resummon them. I'm I'm actually going to resummon. Okay. Because <laughs> they both have ten points of true damage on them. Oh, I see what you mean. So uh, that's yeah. I'm going to do that. Can I loot werewolf teeth? You can. They're not. I mean, yes, but they are currently in human form. They're not in werewolf form right now. Maybe so never will be yes. again. So yes, <laughs> but they are normal. human, normal teeth. But you can say to, like, if you were to bring it to a shop and be all like, I have werewolf teeth for you, they're like, are you serious? Let me see. And you put them on the, on the counter, they're going to be all like, you shouldn't me. <laughs> this, is, this is not werewolf teeth. And you're just like, no, no. They are. Just wait for the full moon. They'll change right in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> the teeth morph. Would that actually happen? No, it makes me I wonder. don't know. Let's find out. <laughs> Would a dead body keep its curse? Nah, I do a lore check to find that out. <laughs> a lore check? Four, never mind. I'll do a lore check to find that out. With a 13. To find what out? If they morph uh, while they're dead still. According to rumor, no, but it's been oh. over two decades or a decade or <laughs> something before anybody or since anybody's seen a werewolf. So, oh, good point. Yeah, people are more likely to kill it than study it. <laughs> what are you looking at, huh? Into the floor. Oh. That was me. I was gonna say, are you sure? Yep, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. What? All right. Do you guys make it back toward the hallway? Yes. Yep. Dun, dun. Upon entering the hallway, you guys see that the pressure plate has risen once again. <laughs> don't touch I it. I do not touch it. <laughs> I don't like that thing. I don't think anyone should touch it. Everybody give me I a d20 to see if you step dirt. over oh. the pressure plate. I mean, we know exactly where it is. Jeff, give me three rolls for each of your oh, people. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that bro. I'm going to go last. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go last. Nah, nah. Yeah. You guys can go ahead. Trevor. 13. Uh, Just be- plus dex? Yes. And 23. Cool. You kickflip over it. And by kickflip, I mean you you make a skateboard, then kickflip over it. Not that I don't trust my party members, but I'm going to like just Love hop it. and then keep going. I'm, I'm putting some yeah, distance no, I here. I want to go into the other room in case yeah. somebody yeah. fucks up. Yeah, please, just everyone leave the room yeah. before I traverse <laughs> right. over it. Embry, I, upon hopping over it, he goes... <laughs> <laughs> he flaps his little wings. Yeah, his little wings go... <laughs> <He gets some wind. laughs> Um, I got 11. Good. He's like, Great. All of you have survived so far. Okay. And I get the hell out of that room. As fast right. as possible. Time to GTF. Okay, well, if you're opening the, do- the door on the other side, I'm going to do this now, before tra- before Jeff can roll. Okay. Upon opening the, the next door, you guys are hit with a vibrant green light. Ooh. And there are two men waiting for you on the Ooh. other side. They both spin their heavy staffs and point them at you like Keelik from Soul Calibur. Fuck that guy. And I love that guy. Yeah. I hate Nightmare and Siegfried. Anyway. <laughs> yeah. I tell them to hold on a sec. We're waiting for the last person to get through. They're like, very well, go on. <laughs> I, I'm, okay, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm imagining the Gates of Oz and the gatekeeper <laughs> with his long staff. <laughs> <laughs> Not, nobody back no how. <laughs> As Katie says, hold on a second. We're waiting for someone. They're like, okay. And they put their stab ends into the green focus crystal <laughs> behind them. They pull it out, and the end of the green staves, or the, the end of the staves have turned green. Damn. And they point that end towards you guys. Great. I'm gonna wonder that is on my, on my keyblade. Um, how far away uh, am I and the minions from the rest of the party? About 15 feet. And was I able to discern the radius of the trap last time it triggered? It hit what if you hit it, like hit the pressure plate, the trap hit everywhere in the hallway, but the pressure plate itself is only a square foot. Okay, so but the, the hallway party, is narrow. The but but the party is safe because they're in the in the yes. green light room. Yes. Okay, so knowing that, I am going to have myself go over first 
and go into the green room. I love how this is a process because he has no decks at all. He's like, fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah. <laughs> I rolled a four. Oh, no. <laughs> God damn it. That's some crossbow bolts of your ass. Um, do I have that reroll? You are fine. Oh. You are fine. Super. I tell my minions to wait as I walk into the green room, and then I turn around and I go, here, boys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then I want them to go over at the same time. Oh, God. With a nine plus... It's fine. Okay. And a six. It's fine. Oh, super, super duper. Your four was okay, so I'm not too concerned. I was looking for five and higher. If it was under five, there was a chance that you would fall. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. So. And then I have them join me in the green room. You guys are now, now all inside the green room, and the monks inside here look very seasoned, and they say, we're giving you one chance to back away. I go. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> The Can monk who didn't talk. Can I start cackling along with Zilfin? What? Can I start cackling along with Zilfin? But yes. yes. The rest of us are just like. Why do you want us to back off? <laughs> <laughs> Can't you see we're just traveling <laughs> through here? <laughs> Killing people along the way through this fortress. I've killed no one. <laughs> your, your members have. Uh, members? You mean member? Uh, oh, tiefling. <laughs> You're right. Bro, Killer bye. genie. <laughs> uh, those two. I'm not with them. <laughs> yeah, I don't know these guys. <laughs> Does it look like I travel with a tiefling laughing. and a murderous genieling? Yes. Oh. So she and I are Trevor. like inching away. <laughs> and Jeff. <laughs> so you guys are. You were hit with twenty physical damage. Oh my heavens! Jesus Christ, how the hell does that work? From the staff, from the green ends of the staff. Like, was it a zap attack? No. Is Was this tauntable? Like Dragon Ball Goku Extendy Pole action? Extendy pool? No. I was like, what the hell? They didn't even roll. They no, I did. I rolled while you guys were cackling. Yeah. They leapt forward and jabbed you with the ends. I know, so they're the within end, range now. And the yes, and the green energy hit you guys and auto crit. You need to destroy may them. I, Just those may I please? I tag. <sighs> so you do you taunt one or do you taunt both of them? I'm so okay with being hit, just to let you know. Okay, I taunt one. Okay. Trevor, you are spared 20 damage. Woohoo! Thank you, Jesus. You take 19 damage because of your... Yeah. And yeah. I also take 19 damage. <laughs> if you're okay. Then... No, I'm, I'm, I'm super okay with it because... Um, may I please react to that? Mm-hmm. No. Do I, I take any... I'm sorry. If, I'm that's sorry. okay. Yeah. Thanks! Roll me the 20. Bless, Bless you, you, son. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Um, I have... I have, um, I have my father, Shambles, walk forward, and I use my instant ability, Corpse Explosion, Ew. to blow oh God. them up, dealing 18 true damage to both of them. And then, since Shambles is no longer active, Drain Life is empowered again. And I'm going to cast tr Drain Life on the left... Well, actually, on the one that hit me. The right one. The right one. Fuck that guy. So I cast Drain Life on him, putting me down to 4 MP. Oh, shit. And I'm starting to feel like we're maybe not a very good uh, group of people. Well, I, I think so. <laughs> yeah. You not guys are yet. pretty great. We're young. <laughs> we're young. <laughs> we, yeah, we oh, don't understand. Uh, yeah. Uh, dr drain Life uh, failed, you guys, so... Um, Damn it. I'm, I'm suddenly regretting my decision. Oh my Wait. god. Jinx said, it's your turn. You? Yes. What? I'm, I'm regretting my decision because I have oh, I have 17 HP thing? now. Okay, I was we'll win anyway. confident that I, my drain life was going to work, and then it didn't, and I'm not, now I'm just like, yeah. fuck. Just burn your MP. Charge. What? Along, to burn your MP. No. no. Along with oh, your, uh, yeah. Yeah. along with your emotion that you acquired, it seems you have an ego too now. <laughs> I do not comment. <laughs> no comment. No. Thirty. Trevor. Um. Guy who tagged Jinxa. Okay. Heroic strength. 
Got it. Katana strike. Where'd it go? There it is. Masamune strike. Is 24, all told. Hit. So that's 35 damage. Oh. Damn. KT. Roll a d4. Odds versus I evens for a random target for your I thing. Did 36. <laughs> Sorry. I'm going to a number again. It's okay, I got it. Oh, okay. It was a 1 8. Bad. So roll the d10 plus your magic for that. Okay. Actually, he dies. Never mind. Wait, what? Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. All right, well, the other one I am going to instantly cast fire on. With the, wait, that's wrong. That's a wrong way, dice. Forget, corpse explosion triggers high threat like a blood mage does. I got a two. Fizzle. Blood, you Jeff, yes. you've already gone. <laughs> Jenny, go on. And that means I should probably heal you and her. Um, but wait. She got hit for 20. Yes. She has more HP than you. Um, I'm at 17 and she's at yeah, what? Yeah, yeah, so she's looking right at it as I was trying to think about what I was getting. Oh. Order. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna heal you. Oh, fuck nope. shit. <laughs> Let's try Cameron. <laughs> oh, God. But he's. I... Let's try Jeff okay. again. No, it's okay. Just, it's okay, man. It's gonna hit him next. It's, it's your oh, turn. Geez, okay. But I have a bunch of magic okay. to add to three. Nope. Auto fizzles. Okay, I'm gonna flash heal you then, you big stinker. <laughs> you big bimbo. They bounced off something. No, too late. Uh, um, at the end of the player phase, I have a minor action left. I need I'm the jerky on my belt from session one to restore <laughs> four HP. In a row. You nom on jerky while the stave guy goes. That was pathetic. Oh, it bounced down. off of something. <laughs> stave guy uses a minor action to stab the green crystal again with the other end of the staff. Fuck, I'm sorry, bro. Bend it over or swing it back around and then jab at you. Me? <laughs> I mean, looked at Cameron. Ooh. It's okay. It's like right next to me. I ate I jerky for taunt. a reason, you guys. I taunt. God damn it. He misses. Misses. Oh. Yeah. Because he rolled a nat one, so that negates oh. the nat crit. So, Super. misses. Player phase. Cameron's turn. <gasps> it's does, banana bread time! Does the banana. taunt that I did, does that automatically um, burn yeah. the MP? Uh, yes. Okay. I'm sorry. I, I just really, really want to say I love the fact that I had my opening round planned out so perfectly. I was all confident, like, oh yeah, well, I'm going to blow up my skeleton so Drain Life gets better and then heal myself with Drain Life. Fuck, it failed. <laughs> heal and failed. Jerky. Oh. Then we had two fizzles. Good thing I have yeah. this jerky. Two, three, Cameron, three, do you want Trevor to go? I'll go for it. No, okay, I go ahead. Better. I rolled a fucking There's shot. only one target. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna do a regular attack. Okay. Push it. Twenty-one. Hit. What? I haven't rolled actual damage for this in so long. I almost forgot what the damage is. I was, I was gonna say it's been a while since I've heard you say I'm gonna do a regular attack. Yeah. Back right. in like session two, maybe. Time. I do a lot of flashy shit. All right, so it's two d six. That's three plus two is five plus twelve. Twenty-two. Twenty-two Wait, cunning and strength, right? Mm. Yep. So seventeen. He is dead. Yeah. Wow, these guys weren't too bad. That's why I didn't do a roll strike. Well, they had a lot of deeps. True. They could They're have like done 40 cannons. damage to one person. They could. True. You both take, or you both, you all take 200 XP from from beating off. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. From <laughs> killing, from killing off. Wow. Uh, from, you from, could say we played with their status. Yeah. From <laughs> killing oh, off oh. these two older monks. Oh my god. <laughs> the green crystal glows beautifully That's in front of you. Immediately. I immediately grab it first. No, I'm just kidding. Whoever rolls first. As you reach out to touch it, it zaps and explodes in an Shut unholy up, burst. <laughs> and you're like, that was horrifying. My character, uh, I Damn it. On it, by the way. I was like, Whoa. Damn. As it explodes, it, it seems that. like gemstones are about to slice into your face. But as soon as they make contact with your skin, they turn into ash. Oh, thank God. And you're like, oh, that was scary. <laughs> Ooh, was it um, rainbow colored? The only <laughs> other way to leave this room is immediately to your left. I loot their bodies. The bodies have two staves. They are both Joe staffs with heavy ornamental things at the end of bo on both ends that would hit harder. They are 1d6 plus 3 melee weapons. Mm. Mm, the plus 3 bonus makes it, makes it really nice. What are they called uh, again? They're Joe staffs. Like J O E? 
J O. Oh, okay. Um, can I, Katie, you taking one or you taking both? I'll take one. All right. Um, Call I them. Actually have the other plate Joe staff that I took earlier. But can I like swap it out for the fancy one? Yeah. Call Do them, it. Call them either martial artist Joe staffs or like augmented Joe <laughs> staffs. Make them something different, whichever whatever reward you guys want to use, because they're different than, than traditional. One d six plus three. Yes. <laughs> Reinforce the Joe staff. If you so we go into the next room. <coughs> yes. All yes. our focus. When you open the room, open the door to the room. Please edit that out. <laughs> when you open the room, people when you, love that stuff. When you open the door <laughs> to the next room, you guys are embraced by the image of a forest. You know that you are still inside because you can see a ceiling above you, right. and there is a circular sky uh, skylight mm -hmm. that looks up into the stars. Ooh. It is daylight outside. Ooh. You see, like. What seems to be <laughs> the beginning of a forest leading on into the room. You don't know how deep it is or how big it is. Is it dark? Is it red? It is quite dark, despite the fact that light is coming from that sky, uh, skylight. There are two men on their hands and knees, audibly praying for guidance and protection to Palma. They seem quite... Wrong God, dude. They seem quite <laughs> scared. Palma herself oh. is sitting directly in front of you on a tree stump about four feet off the ground. And I want all of you to give me a d20 to see something. Is it a palm tree? Twelve. Plus what? Is there a plus? There is no bonus. Four. Twelve. What? Eleven? Eleven. Ten. You guys all know that you have seen her before. Seen her before, but you are not quite sure where. So we know it's Palma, and we you okay? No, I should say you are surmising that it's Palma okay. because it's the it's a little. I girl. recognize her like the palm of my hand. Oh. <laughs> the palm of my hand. <laughs> okay. I would give you such a Palma. Nice right now, <laughs> Palma <laughs> sprout. <laughs> Palma is a very small girl. She, her legs easily do not reach down the tree stump to the ground. She is small. Okay, so she's a very small girl, but her expression is that of an adult who has experienced generations, generations, decades of strife and frustration and doubt. She is looking at you very, like very much desiring to do you harm. And also she seems disappointed. As you guys enter this foresty room, one of you steps on a twig, and the two men Snap. hop up into a ready stance and get ready to fight. But she says, stop. They killed so many of your brothers. Do you think that you're going to fare any better? And the two men, embarrassed, look at each other, then look back at you and get out of their defensive stances. Palma puts her hands up, like, as if to shrug, and she says, I guess I was wrong about all of you, huh? Mm -hmm. She's the uh, creator of Genie Links. She's the creator of Dragons. Dragons, that's right. That's right. Dragon. I keep switching them. Almost. I keep fucking switching them. God damn it. Noel is Genies. Yes, thank Palma you. is Dragons. Balls is just some guy I like. It's Palma <laughs> says, when you broke the seal of lycanthropy, I thought that you were actually standing for the earth and creatures and people that I created. But I see now that you are not a follower of me and you actually care nothing for the world because if you did you would have stopped as soon as you learned the truth from that man in the bedrooms when he told you their true nature so tell me what are you doing i'm just gaining in here in a very I, violent way of acquiring i have info. not killed anyone i've been defending myself and my comrades that's it you know. Look, I've got a dragon with me. I'm <laughs> raising him. <laughs> I'm bringing him into violence. I am oh, not. you. You little girl. I his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> you look over at Emery and he's actually gnawing on raw meat and he's like, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> And she's like, Is he a Norwegian Ridgeback? No. <laughs> <laughs> Reference five. Hungarian <laughs> <laughs> She says to you, I have no doubt that you have good intentions, 
but you are by no means his proper mother. <laughs> there was no mother around. Hmm. The only mother he had didn't want him. Too. He Asshole. also didn't have a father because... Then if you, then if you really would... care about him, offer him back to me. What would you do to him? I'm the mother of all nature and animals. Then why weren't you there for him when he needed you? How do you want him? He's an animal, a creation of nature. Therefore, he's my child. Wouldn't that mean that... He's also that... got a bunch of brothers and sisters back at the, the Red, White, Red Riding Hood place. And they will come to me when <laughs> I call them. Gilded Red. Gilded Red. That, that's it. I Wouldn't uh, technically anything be your child then? Anything of nature, animalistic. I'm a fucking bunny. <laughs> <laughs> and half of you is belongs to me. Is it bad that I want to fight a god? Then what does it matter to you that I have that I raise him? Because you're not draconian. You're not a dragon. You don't know how to raise him properly. What are you? Who said I was raised by anything? I can be raised by dragons, you wouldn't know. She's got a point. I find this tiresome. <laughs> that makes two of us. That's your self to blame. Though, will you so. submit and leave, or will you proceed like fools? I like proceeding like fools. That's not my, my MO. My question is. This little kid's pissing me off, not gonna lie. My question is, like, what are exactly are we aiming I for? Agree, here? I agree with I you. You guys, exactly. given, you guys were given a job to, to find the werewolves. In I didn't the want to kill that. the werewolves personally. I didn't. I have no qualm with the werewolves. They, they're not hurting anybody. I'm fine. They just... tried to kill us when we entered the goddamn castle. After okay. we killed some of them. Yeah, when we went in the first room, remember? Yeah, but All we're also the invading their. Butcher knives and ladles and shit. Invading yeah, them. but it's their home. You know, yeah. where they went far, far away to never be seen again over decades, like you said. So why would we go hunting something that's been hidden for a long time and done no harm to anyone else and not unsure if they even existed at that point? She stands up on her stump and she says, You see, this is why I hate humans. And the two men in front of her go, Ouch. She's like, <laughs> Sorry. But seriously, this <laughs> is why I hate mortals because you guys are so indecisive you just act because you have some sort of desire but then you feel bad about it later no animals just do they what don't. they naturally want to do and they call, they follow through with it they have instinct they carry everything through their heart but you guys that's why i have a maternal instinct werewolves aren't just animals though they're humans with the same decisions like us but in their true form they are pure animal Mm-hmm. It's arguable that that's that. Then why haven't they been in true form for so long? Because the seal of lycanthropy prevented them from turning. Oh, and, shit, and you guys broke it. Mm. So now it allows them to turn back. That's why they were called back home. Mm -hmm. Back to me. You can only argue that it was their true form if they were born like that. Mm-hmm. Because the werewolf was never born. It mm. was created. Mm. From something else. From me. They were cursed. They were human first. Yes. A cursed life. And then I turned them, <laughs> and then I turned them into were my image. They were cursed, not gifted. Their true form would be human. You took a human form and twisted it. This is true. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. No one's born a werewolf. Well, well then you sound a little... Uh, like, like, ah, Unless like, you're going to twist the lore around like Twilight. <laughs> you kind of sound like a human to me um, with your decisions to kind of twist things in your own view, like, then. Is she I appearing mean... to us in the form of a human, too? Mm hmm <laughs> Okay. Alrighty. All right. I like that gods have an ego to make themselves think that they're different <clears throat> from humans, but they're not. Yeah. Yeah. That's very true. Everybody makes mistakes. So. She puts her hands up and says, I see that only one of you has not spoken, and frankly, I don't give a shit what he has to think. Shut your mouth. <laughs> I will not. I'm over 12,000 years old. You yeah. shut your mouth. She says, we're not going to find peace here, so I'm just going to show you what my creations can do. And in the skylight, a, a artificial moon appears Great. and shines down on the two men, and they begin to turn into werewolves. Guys, it's See, fake. that's cruel. It's, that's, it's not real. Let's run. Stop that. Well, to answer your initial question, the reason why we're here... Palma disappears. <laughs> Thank you for picking up the joke. 
she said, I guess cover bro. He said that she disappeared, so I was like, well, my joke's dead. But you got <laughs> my back. Palma uh, disappears by turning around and seeming to, like, open a curtain that's not there. Like, a veil. A veil and stepping through it. Yeah. I'm a bitch, quietly to myself. The two men quickly become werewolves that are dirty brown with red eyes and yellow teeth. They are salivating something monstrous. And they go, time for dinner. Hmm. Can I react? Yes. She turned them into feral wolves. I think that it's uh, pretty obvious what she's calling you. She's a little hypocrite. (laughs) Reference six. (laughs) (laughs) You guys are so close. (laughs) I get it. We deserve XP for this. I just want to switch to that bow that I've got and fire one of the silver arrowheads right at one of them. Better roll a twenty. Do you are you okay with him going before you? Yeah. Okay. Reaction. Range, range is technically first, but anyway, but Fuck. Still. Oh no. It was it's right next to the twenty. I rolled a two. Oh. What's so your dex? It's right next to the twenty. Two hands anymore because oh, uh, it's like a ten. Uh, Miss. Fuck. Please keep track. Of, please keep track of how many silver arrowheads you have. Oh yeah. shoot! God. Uh, That's what I get for playing with dice. Shot, eh, so. Sorry. I Pick can up. either charge That's now or I can taunt later. Charge That's now the or forever hold your peace. That's well, the taunt's only... Taunt's instance, you can always taunt whenever you need be. But I mean, MP-wise, I don't have oh, enough. I see, I see. Um, if I you would... charge, I'll take aggro from charging, which would be the most efficient use of MP in terms of wanting to acquire the most aggro possible. <sighs> Oh, I have a greater MP potion. Does that count as a... Can I drink that? If it's on your belt, you can do it in a minor action. If it's in your inventory, you have to go... You have to use uh, it as a major action. Okay. Then I'm just going to use charge. Oh, sorry. Charge! Nine. Whew. Now, how far are the werewolves away from Um... 12 feet away. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 25, yeah, 25. Yeah, Palma has a lot of reason to hate me. That's why I didn't bother talking to her. Mm. Are you an unnatural? Well, I am unholy. I have destroyed the pictures of her, and she created dragons. I got two. Okay, roll it again, please. Me too. So, yeah. Okay, make it. And then, uh, okay. What are you gonna name? Uh, 16 damage from my shock aura. And now I'm gonna use chain lightning. <laughs> With a 12. Yes. Um, chain lightning to Your keyblade goes. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna throw this out there. Um, fire might do more damage to the werewolves. Uh, that's, that's a good point. True. But don't we still have silver? Um,. Yeah, he, he's using the plus, arrow that's right now. Mm. 13 I just plus. My first uh, shot I was trying to be fancy. 13 plus my 12 for the more first target. Fancy flying. So, 25. 25. Yeah, for the first target. And then the second target, you know what to do. I don't know. Random question here. I don't know. Something. I still have a dead silver bat in my inventory. Throw it at him. <laughs> Is that, nah. Does that count? <laughs> like, really hard. It, it casts a, Silver Storm <laughs> into their mouth. Zubat, I choose you. And Jeffrey? I'm... I'm going to have Shady's cast Darkness. Um, Gray back. Do, do either of the werewolves look more than <laughs> Ew, yeah, that character's so gross. I'm reference like, number seven. Like, Congratulations. Uh, you guys reached seven Harry Potter references in one session. How much XP do we get? You guys receive zero XP, but Aww. you will receive a bonus at the end of this session. Yay. Wait, if Yay. we do eight references like the actual oh, eight horcruxes that they didn't realize they had, do we get actually an item? No, because there were only seven horcruxes. No. <laughs> Yeah. Or, or, so, do either one of the werewolves look more menacing or more powerful than the other? No, like they are minutes. quite balanced. So, uh, I'm going to cast Darkness on the one closest to Darkness. 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 It's successful. That werewolf gets minus six on its next attack roll. 
And my character casts Drain Life on the same one. And it is definitely... Oh my god. It is definitely a spell burst. <laughs> 18 spell burst for me because I have 10 willpower now. Cool. <laughs> so that's going to be um, 12 plus... Uh, 6 is 18, plus 20 is 38 damage. 38 damage. And I'm back uh, up. To the, to the same one that was blinded? Yes, and I'm back up to full health as well. Which makes me super happy. <laughs> you uh, having difficulties there, Katie? Just a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Guy. Um, what about your other minion? My other minion was exploded. Oh, that's right. That's right. And Jeff. Yes. You should have lied, Jeff. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's see. Mm, who wants a shield? Somebody needs a shield. Probably Cameron. Yeah. Well, it's yeah. I'm always in need of a shield. Jeff, please remember what your staff can do. That's what I'm imagining that we're fighting. It's pretty close, too but it, but it stands mm. up on its hind legs pretty easily too. I oh, have some mage armor. I know what my staff can do, but um. It, 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 it still costs MP, Cassie. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I don't have enough MP to oh, okay. shambles, okay. that's why. Yeah, You just don't need a physical body. To otherwise, fight. otherwise, I would be summoning shambles. Huh. That. You mean like that? Yeah. Okay. So you get a shield for 16? Who does? Uh, She does. You okay, receive a shield for 16. Cool. And you get Super plus one defense. defense. And this is three turns. Okay. I mean... Right this time. So you get plus one defense for as long shield. as the shield stops. No. Enemy phase. <gasps> and 18 HP? 16. 16. Or 16. The plus one defense as long as you have the shield. Up to three turns. Okay. Anybody else need healing? I can still do an instant. Trevor, what's your defense? Okay. Me? What's your defense? Uh, 12. One goes for Trevor, one goes for Katie. Shit. Whoops, sorry guys. Bye, <clears throat> Tom. Which one? Oh, hold on. Or I can't. Both. I can't. Okay. I don't have enough MP. Trevor, sorry, you take guys. 22. Fucking hell. Katie, sorry. you take... 27. Damn. Player phase. You'll get a shield next, level. I'm, 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 I'm going to stress focusing on only one of the werewolves. Also, yeah. that one of the werewolves is blinded. Uh, what is 36 uh, minus 27, right? Yes. yes. Oh, okay. You're, you're, in, uh, you're up shit creek. Yep. Both Trevor and Katie, give me d20s. No. Did you, did, did you remember Shock Aura? Yeah. Seven. Nine. Are we getting any bonuses? No. You're good. Nah. No. Cameron. Um, I'm going to just attack. Oh, um, I'm going to drink my okay. MP potion, actually. Okay. Is that okay? Yeah. That'll take your full turn. Oh, that's a very Oh, did I roll for that? Uh, or? No. Okay. You're going to roll taunt, um, 46 plus 12. Twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen plus. Seventeen plus twelve, so twenty-nine. Awesome. Well, that's more than full. Can, do I get the surplus? <laughs> no. <laughs> Trevor. Question. Yes. yes. Little Red Riding Hood's cloak. It mm -hmm. gives me resistance to melee attacks from animals and beasts. Yep. So that damage that I took, can I can I uh. I take like twenty five percent off the <laughs> Yes. Oh wow. So what did I take? Twenty two. You took twenty two. Twenty five percent. So call it five. So I actually took seventeen. Yep. I hate you. Good. <laughs> not the not the being hated part, the less damage part. <laughs> oh thank Christ. Okay. Um. You're welcome. Yeah. I'm sorry, Tom. Did you say it was my turn now? Yes. Then I'm going to heroic strike the one that Zilfin already tagged. 
I just realized. That is an 18. Yay. Tommy, does my 1d6 lunar damage bonus have to be, like, hit? Do I have it's to hit them? With oh, okay. Lunar. Lunar. So Jeff, and Jeff and Trevor both just said something as if they wanted to elaborate. I, I rolled 18 for my attack roll. Hits. 35 damage. Actually, it's 100. Holy How much shit, HP do you have? Did you uh, hit with an arrow? Nine. No, it was my, it was my no, it wasn't Oh, that sucks. Ding. Yeah, no, I can't hit. I was reading up on the, the rules, and I can't hit for shit with that bow. So it's just 35. But that's good to know. Yes, so, it is. I uh, actually, as my minor, I got movement and still stuff. Pardon? And stuff and still. <laughs> um, Tommy, where's the tree line? Um, just behind them by about six or seven feet. I sprint for a tree and try and climb up to you seven climb a tree? Just, like the lowest a that I can, just to be able to reach. Fancy ass and, motherfucker. Um, Starts to use my bow again from inside the tree. Uh, you're going to receive quite a minus because that's a very big minor action movement, but we but you can give it a try. All right. Then I'm focusing on getting up the tree. Okay. <laughs> oh, that twenty. Wow. I'm gonna need evidence for that. Wait, 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 wait. That looks like tell. a sixteen to me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're up in a tree. I claim that we. Yeah, I claim that we. You are now Kalina. Uh, yeah. Katie, uh, go on. Um, I'm gonna take some advice and I'm gonna use fire. I forgot to empower my dream life. Fire. Oh, okay. um, damn it. <laughs> so which one's damaged the most right now? You don't know. Well, which one have we been focusing the most? We don't really know. Uh, Trevor. I do. Yeah, Trevor just did 35 and I did 38. To which one? To the one I blinded. Okay, I'll damage the one you blinded. One that's blinded? Before that um, was blinded, that one. I'm gonna set him on fire. Was blinded! With a six. Blinded and so, uh, one d4. Oh, that's not a d4. One. Uh, so, one plus my 12 magic. So, 14. Roll me a d. Oh, yeah. Because, yeah, it's a random target, so you can't select that. You mean for the fire? Oh, fire. I'm sorry. I thought it was meaning for your static <gasps> Oh, thing. oh, okay. And then for, for uh, Shock Aura, this I will do this now. I'm calling a four, and I'm always going to call a four until I get one. Three. Dang it. And then I'm going to roll this. Oh, that's a nine. So nine plus my 12 magic for that as well. So 21. Roll me another d4. Four. Yes, finally. Finally. I knew eventually I would get a four. <laughs> Just always gotta be four. Well, did, did, did he allow you to re-roll your silence? I don't no. know what that was, actually. No. That was mm -hmm. your randomization of the target of that spell. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can give me a D tw you can give me another D4 to see if that 25% oh, chance hit, but I'm not sure if you rolled that. No, oh, I did earlier. Okay. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> What's oh, up, buddy? Oh. <laughs> I'm going to, um, I'm going to, uh, um, <coughs> I'm going to have Shady's cast an Arcane Bolt on, uh, the target that he's been focusing, the blind one. Uh, successful. And one, three, I do eight Arcane Damage. How does that dice work? Is it whatever sitting it's the in the upright? Yeah. Okay. Whatever number's upright. So it does art eight arcane damage. And then I zap Bzzz. as well. Bzzz. Same one? Yes, doing twelve unholy damage. Okay. <laughs> Your turn. I wanna heal Katie. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. I wonder if... Oh, uh, that's a lot. Like, what's your HP total? Uh, 36. Uh, <laughs> I wonder if I should give you the regen. Regen would be good, I would think, right? Because you only have nine. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Uh, mm. I think, I think what, your regular heal might actually heal her. How, how much HP are you missing? Uh, 36 out of nine. I mean, nine out of 36. 
Nine out of thirty six, so you're missing twenty seven. Yeah, yeah, region. Just in case it keeps hitting her. Yeah. Oh. Well, what? How are you doing, Cameron? Oh, wait, I'm, you're okay. I'm okay. There's those two. I'm good. What are you guys at? I'm full. Where are you? I'm at, I'm at 21 of 38. Oh. Damn. Oh, then I'll, I'll, the I'll flash you then in a second. Well, I'll flash <laughs> you oh, oh, oh. in a second. Just Reference number eight. Yeah. Okay. Just, yeah. <laughs> that will not be happening. Sorry for you. <laughs> Got it. 13. Thank you. Uh, wait a second. What does this happen? You get to heal 13 for three turns. Mm. Oh, Regen. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. Well, no, you don't, get to, you don't get to heal 13 each turn. You re-roll it each turn of Regen. Oh, oh so 13 this turn, and then we'll roll again. <laughs> it's it's going to be 13 every time because it just goes off the magic. Oh, you, oh, I'm sorry. I, I'm i sorry. The game is oh. different than it was last time I had Regen. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I learned too. Okay, and I'm instant Trevor. Or flash heal him instantly. Not flash him. Flash him. Flash him. Flash him. Five. Uh. Cast. Okay. Cool, you get 13 too. Okay. 13 comma T-O-O. Okay. Four and... Which means you're 34 of 38, so I am much better now. Thank you. Is your haunting melody still active? Yes. Uh-huh. It's been active this whole time. I just didn't know when to say anything. It's always at the end of, of player phase. Okay. It's the end of phase now. Blood phase? Speak. I need that to be like at you. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Do it again. <laughs> like what is that sound? Yeah, I don't know about Seven. that. That's how you do it, right? Uh, <laughs> 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 sure. Oh, I went to the bathroom. Sorry. Sorry, friends. She's got a pot of countrymen ears. Unbelievable <laughs> uh, Englishman. <laughs> Enemy phase. One goes for Trevor. One goes for Katie again. God damn it. Thank you, Cameron. Which one do you taunt or which yes. one? I taunt both. Taunt both. Um, oh, damn. Mine went AWOL. Hold on. It's on the other side. Oh. Uh, That's when a bunny goes, Come here, doggy doggy dog. Oh, fuck, I'm a bunny versus two rabid werewolves. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck am I going to do? Kill it. That's one brave bunny. Mm-hmm. I'm like, rocket, rocket, rocket. Cameron, I'm very sorry, but um, all four hits hit you. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> you are hit for, for 44 damage. Jesus. And defense is 16. I know. Okay. And so subtract that 16 first. So yeah. 44 minus 16 is 28. And okay, also, 28. Uh, 27, if actually. If it's four separate hits, then you would save four damage. So because... it's actually 24. Sorry. 24. Because it's damage reduction yeah. on each one of the separate hits. You are right. 24? Mm-hmm. The life of a tank, man. <laughs> yep. That's why it's nice. Reduction. It's good shit, bro. Real 33. life. Woo. I'm down to 33. Player phase. Mm. So. It ain't my turn. So I so no so. longer have the shield, because that thing yep. got yep. used up. Mm-hmm. I can't believe all four hits, man. 16 defense. I rolled 16, 16, 11, 17. Right. Damn. They have enough decks to composition. Just enough. I'm just going to use my ice sword. Shut okay. up. Shut up. Nine. Shut up, man. Shut up, man. Seven. <laughs> that was a very Narnia. Shut up, you. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, three, four, three, four, but shut up, Meg works too. Seventeen. <sighs> to the one on your left or the one on your right? Uh, to the window. The one on my to the right. <sighs> Slap <laughs> down my ball. <laughs> Trevor. <laughs> they are both directly in front of Cameron. <laughs> oh, sh- uh, so I have Sorry, Ducks Report. Is Right? It's like, <laughs> what's going on over there? Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm keeping that. I'm owning that. Uh oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> I want to shoot the one that we've been targeting in the back with a sword. Okay. My lady balls. <laughs> Okay, so it's a sec. With bonuses, that's, uh, 23. It hits. It dies. Damn, it's died. I'm so colorblind. I look the same I'm down to nine arrows. <clears throat> nine arrows. Cameron, take back 20 HP. Take back? Oh. It was blinded. Blinded. It shouldn't have been oh. able to. Oh. So I only have five. Wait, wait. What blinded it? You blinded it. It, it was on, it was a one turn blind. My skeletal mage only has a one turn blind because it's a lesser form. I have spoken. I'm sorry. <laughs> He's I mean, lost it. It's gone. Yeah, it's gone. It's a razor. It's not an electric razor. <laughs> um. No, sorry, racer. Katie. There is only one werewolf left, and it is mourning its companion. I tamed it. Is no. he really? Yes. That's really sad. Yes. I just let him wear the red for a minute. He even lets out a loud, a loud howl to the moon that's above it. It's like, it looks, it, it's a fake moon, but I don't care. Oh, <laughs> fake moon thing. That's, this is so DBZ right now. Uh, well, it. that's really sad. I feel bad. I'm going to set it on fire. <laughs> <laughs> For the boat team. Uh, so one D four. That's so sad. I set it on fire. Make it feel better. Yeah. So I hit it for fifteen it fire yeah. damage. Yeah, like, give it that internal warmth. <laughs> and then I'll roll for the uh, shock aura. Uh, I'm gonna say four. One. It automatically uh, hits it. So. Yeah. True. Um, okay, so now it's gonna be nine plus twelve for damage for my shock order. Twenty-one. Mm -hmm. Jeffrey, what's up, dude? I saw it. Dude. <laughs> I'm gonna have um, I'm gonna have Shadiest Cast, uh, Darkness on it, which is the one. The, this the one, one turn. One turn. Succeeds, and I'm gonna do that for a twelve unholy. Jenny. Yes, um. it's my turn. Yep. What? I'm, I'm not shaking my head at you. I swear I'm not shaking my head at you. Okay. Huh, uh, uh. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, I can't focus. <laughs> Proper damage, Trevor. I'm sorry. I think it got, it hit you again, right? No, it hit her for four attacks. Uh, so I no longer have the shield. No more shield. Hmm. What's your damage? Dude, what's your damage? <laughs> I'm only down five out of 58. I'm good. Is that aggro on you, though? Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Uh, 13 to her. 13 yeah. to her. Katie, oh, you're yeah. healed 13 automatically. <gasps> oh, that's right. Thank Sorry. you. Yep. I'm just wondering if, someone, if I should put a shield on somebody else. How are you doing? I'm almost I'm full, full, except for one point of health. I think that you should take this moment, Jenny, to really absorb the possibility that you could, in fact, Do as a it. healer, attack a werewolf with a vorpal blade. Yeah. A what? Snicker snack, motherfucker. <laughs> Use your summon sword to be like... <laughs> Oh, do my cheap little blow that I usually do when they're almost dead? Okay. Mm -hmm. I like doing that. Okay. Mm -hmm. not, not, not the zappy zap, the swordy sword. Yeah. Trust me. Difference. I'm gonna use my sword. sword. Eighteen. Use Hit. <laughs> well, then, sorry. Well, uh, what's it do? Yeah, one d six four plus magic is mm, 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 seventeen. There's that half willpower thing. Enemy phase. Does that help? Cool. Yeah, it did damage. I don't know what I'm gonna do. So therefore help? It casts a spell. Oh. Yes. The werewolf casts a spell. Oh. It it's... is called Blood Moon. I they're, said they're magic. They're magic, aren't they? I absorb. It is AoE. You hit. cannot absorb AoE. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
She's going to be upset about it, Tommy. You're, it. you're going to hear about it. I didn't yeah, know I know. Magic. I would have put next a, the barrier on. <laughs> 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 the middle you of the night. Be nice She's like, you know what? You should, you should let me fucking absorb blood. Moon fucking Everybody give me a D20. <laughs> <That's how> they... <laughs> Everybody give me a D20 willpower check. I should have put barrier on you. I didn't know they were magical. Hey, Tommy, guess who has no willpower? <laughs> Not me. I have seven. 18. 16. 16 plus my five. 18. 17 plus 10. Wow. I rolled 15. 15. 15. All of you resist mass fear. Yeah. I'm immune to fear. I'm telling you where I have a half of me. Yeah, the genies have something against... You have a 50% chance to resist it, but they automatically resisted it. Anyway. It's called Cosmic Mind. Read up. Read up on it. Read up on it. Sometime. I was going to. You're such an asshole. Why am I even friends? Just kidding. Mostly. Mostly. Oh, look, there it is written right there. Kyle's going to wonder if crazy. All of you are dealt. Your mom's cousin of mine. From what? 27 true damage. Lord! But I have cause of mine. From what? From the blood moon. And oh, it's it, mass fear and damage? It is mass fear and damage. <laughs> and then it collapses on its, hi- on its uh, hands and knees, hardly able to move. And I can't taunt that. No, it's Naomi. Player phase. Twenty-seven. Yes. I can't heal myself. Or, or you simple. said. You said that it collapses. It collapses on his hands and knees. Like he's done. The moon. Like it is helpless. Mm. Oh yeah, the moon also turned red. Creepy. I am absolutely walking over to the werewolf and killing it. And grab its neck. Can I, can I join him? I wanted to do that too. Just like walk up and just arrow point blank his face. I go, stop! My wow. character, my character <laughs> realized that you have silver at your disposal, so I let you. Katie, I, Katie calls out for you guys to stop. I quickly I walk to the wolf. And say, why? I ignore them and I walk to the wolf and I stand in front of it. What, Cameron? Say I run over and I jam the dead silver pet down its throat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. You said you were hungry. Here, eat. Well, I don't know. If, I don't know if my role counted for. <laughs> you are so shaky with your movements. You just got hurt and you're battling. It's a werewolf and it's scary. You're just like here, take this and you're jamming it into its eye. <laughs> Me standing between it with a 17 doesn't count. So, that Katie, one. what do you do? <laughs> well, I was, I rolled a 17, but I said Somebody I was going to go stand between it and everyone else. Okay, Katie is standing in between you two and the oh werewolf. But I'm guessing it's dead now. No. Oh. She missed and started smacking the bat into his <laughs> So what are you, what are you doing? Okay, uh, it's not for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just, I don't know, my character doesn't want to watch someone die that's not doing anything at this point. So, he just tried to kill us all. I don't care. <laughs> yeah. He's obviously done. Zilfin, what do you do? Don't touch my lightsaber. <laughs> That's your lightsaber? No. My good friend Jeff gave it to me. Uh, but all I see is Zilfin. I don't know. My character... Well, okay, I'll explain why my character is doing this. Because he was turned forcefully into this wolf. Mm-hmm. And by Miss... You're assuming I'm so this. About but yes. Well, I mean, I think didn't, didn't you say she God. casted something? The very the original werewolf, yeah. the original wolf, was created by her. Yeah. And since then, he contaminated other people, who contaminated others, who contaminated others. Yeah. He, this one in front of you, you don't know how he got the curse. Which you, I won't bother to assume. Palma yes. made an artificial moon to turn them into werewolves. So it's Which safe to assume up. that it was already a werewolf. Yeah, but she forcefully turned him by making an artificial moon to kill us. Meaning she doesn't care about his life. She's using him to kill us. And I think it's pretty dumb. And obviously he's not going to fight back anymore. So there's no point in killing something that's not going to fight back. I placed myself in front of the werewolf where, like, facing Luna where she's standing. And I have Shadies go around the backside. Katie, give me a d20. I was gonna chain lightning your your summon. Give me a d20. Okay. Two. Before this goes too cray cray, can Phobos say something too? Yes. He's just gonna ask, all right, if we don't kill him, what you plan on doing with him? I don't know. I just plan on not killing him, and I think it's wrong to kill him, and I think if you guys kill him, then I'm going to view you all differently. 
Fair point, Twy, but we gotta plan ahead further if we're gonna do something about this. By the way, I've taken the arrow off the bow okay. right at this point. Okay. So. The shade is in position. Mm hmm. Shade has cast Arcane Bolt on Werewolf. Ooh. It's successful. Mm hmm. Katie, and do deals, you react by, by chain lightning? I'm going to chain lightning. How many summons do you have right now? One. It deals 11 arcane damage. Okay. That's it's the only summon I have right now is the mm. shades. Okay, so I was going to chain you, lightning you did, all your summons. If you did chain lightning, it would hit the summon and Zelfin. Yeah, I know. I'm not going to do anything. I'm just going to walk away from them all. And leave. And not be if there If the arcane anymore. bolt didn't kill it, I kill it. The arcane bolt killed it. Okay. It does not make a sound as it hits the ground. The moment that it dies, the white moon vanishes, and pure sunlight comes down to the skylight. The fur on these bodies does not recede. They do not change back into human, because they are now dead. So the magic in them is kind of like sealed permanent. Take yeah, it answers that teeth. question. Mm. So if we did have teeth, it wouldn't change. Hmm. <laughs> Take the teeth of these guys. How does Katie react? I don't, because I'm not there anymore. Where did you go? Wherever the exit is. T20. <laughs> <laughs> uh, seven, wait, what, 14. You see stair, a staircase off to the right of where you guys were fighting. Mm -hmm. So there's like, the, you entered, there was Palma, there was the wolves. Off to the right, there was a staircase leading up somewhere. Do you take the staircase up and away from them to like get out of, get out of here? Or do you go back the way you came? Uh, I'll take the stairway. Okay. Mm -hmm. The stairway to heaven. Nah. <laughs> I will say that you guys see her scamper off. Zilfin, I imagine, cares the least. <laughs> but actually, no, your summon cares the least. Technically, yes. Probably, nah. probably Jenny's sword cares the it's absolute in, least. It's incapable you know? of carrying. Pew, pew, yeah. pew. So, pew, pew. Katie... Hmm? My ethereal you open double doors that are at the very top, and you find yourself on the roof of the fortress. Mm. In front of you is a circle of men, stay, are all kneeling on their hands and knees, like hands out to their sides, open. And they are casting a spell, a very ancient-sounding spell, because they have a thaumaturgica in front of them. Mm -hmm. oh. Doing something with this glyph that's in front of them, and it appears that they're trying to summon something. Hmm. And you look on, and you're kind of like, I'm su in such bereavement of this werewolf that they killed downstairs, I don't even know how to react to this right now, mm -hmm. that the, ca the circle bursts. The Magicka kind of exceeds capacity and bursts and insta-kills everyone in the circle. Damn. As if the spell, as if the spell went wrong. Well, that's why you don't play with the higher level. <laughs> I knew I had a reason to fear the Thaumaturgica. <laughs> I was like, gonna open it like... <laughs> <laughs> the rest of the party, do you follow Katie up? Yeah, I will. Yeah, I do. Jenny, yes? Yeah. I'm your healer. I'm gonna go with you. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> oh wait, the third tick of the heal. Can I do that yes, now? Yes, you can do that. Oh, cool. uh, I have not given you XP for a reason. I I, I follow Cosmo once I see Cosmo leave. Oh thanks, bro. Do you leave your summon behind? No. Oh, okay. Um, my summon is on auto follow. I I click the icon in the lower portion of the HUD on my screen. <laughs> Okay. Um, <laughs> as you guys reach the top of the staircase, is this a World of Warcraft and you, reference? And you yes. reach, <laughs> okay, and you so. reach Luna. <laughs> yes, we do. And you reach Luna. Mm -hmm. You see just beyond Luna the same circle that she was looking upon, except Luna, while you guys were going up the stairs, was partaking in the resurrection of the Great Wolf. Oh. And the great wolf is standing pretty close to her, just still inside the circle, and he is not looking remotely threatening towards her. He is not growling, he's not anything like that. And 
he looks incredibly sentient hmm. and intelligent. And he stands up on his, on his hind legs with long, burly arms with uh, very black, very black, very dark black fur. And as he sees all of you come up onto the roof, he considers all of you and just sort of waits. Hmm. I'll consider it. Hmm. Yeah. Right. Damn. Yellow green eyes. Surprisingly white teeth. He takes good. He has good uh, dental hygiene. He doesn't say anything. No, he waits for to see what you guys do. I, I just kind of very out of character, and I keep my goddamn mouth shut. <laughs> I just kind of. I guess my character would just kind of watch him and wait to see what would happen. Same. Waiting game. What? Jeffrey. Waiting game. Oh, waiting Come game. Along, oh, waiting for Zilfin to do something. Um, <laughs> if he doesn't do it. Excuse me, Great Wolf. Do you know about the werewolves in the forest? <laughs> <laughs> we're on a quest. <laughs> just, uh, we're on a quest to assassinate all the werewolves. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, Question. I, hold on. Hold on. Oh, you know what? It's a question. Go ahead. I'm sorry. The bodies. Are they still there? Yes. I killed them all. No, out of rage. Chain <laughs> <laughs> lightning everywhere. Right? Again, look at the bodies. Like, damn, last week you been hating. Oh God. <laughs> the Trevor D twenty. <laughs> Ten. Does that get bonuses? Cunning. Sixteen. You guys know. You notice that there is no blood on his claws or his teeth. You notice that the thaumaturgica by the circle, and you notice that these men were not hurt by a blunt object. And so I, I surmise there was something magical. Yes. I'll just straight up and tell them that he was summoned and he didn't murder any of these men. I suppose that would get rid of any ambiguity as well. <laughs> the great wolf perks up at the sound of your voice saying he didn't do it. And he reaches up as if to grab a button or a dial that's in the air and he turns it. And as he's turning his claws, the sun seems to recede back down below the horizon and you guys are being t uh, transported through time, and you are seeing different images flash before you, and he plays it, and he plays it then back forward, and he shows you what he wants you to see. What you see is what you get. Is a girl with very dark uh, black hair in a very long red cloak. You see Red, Red Riding Hood perform an ancient spell with a thaumaturgica, and she is splitting her soul in attempts to discard everything that she deems distasteful about herself. In, Red, so... in, in Red's case, it was in order to rid herself of her doubt, her fear, and her masculinity. However, she did not realize that once she split her soul, the other half of her soul would know exactly what she was intending to do with it. The Great, the great Wolf is the other half of her soul. The great, the great wolf ran from her and to the only, the only safe place that Red herself knew of, which was the village in which her grandmother lived. Red, fearful of what the wolf might do, killed or tried to attack and accidentally killed her grandmother and blamed the wolf. The wolf ran again and ran to the village in which the three little pigs lived, on the border of the Enchanted Forest. Their battle ensued, and she just barely won, killing him, but in the process she also killed the pigs and destroyed the village. She blamed him for that, too. In other words, she has blamed him for things that she has done, and the Great Wolf has actually barely had a chance to live at all. But in that time trying to defend himself against men who she had, who Red turned against him when he was trying to defend himself, he accidentally turned them into werewolves. But it's still her, technically. It is still her. Oh, this is Red. Hmm. So technically, if we killed Red... So, after that, people re regarded her as a hero and raised the guild in her name as the champion of her own fear and also the champion of one of the greatest beasts that was ever created and people don't know how he was created. Hmm. But now the five of you do. It's very Dragon Age. And then as the story concludes, he turns the dial back and you guys are back on, to the, on the roof of the fortress. 
and he looks back at you and just waits again. Hey. What do you intend to do? I go up and I tentatively pet him on the head. <laughs> yes, Trevor? I reach up. 20. I take Red's I cloak the crap off of oh. his head. <laughs> and I throw it at his feet. As he sees the gesture of you discarding something that was Red's, originally Red's, and sees this tiny little bunny thing, because he's like seven feet tall, mm. this tiny little bunny that's less than half his height come up to him and say, I want to pet you. <laughs> he crouches down to one knee and lets you pet his muzzle, and he sees the cloak get discarded at his feet, and he looks at it, then looks up at the tiefling, and there's still no malice on his face. Just kind of a regarding of what you have just done. Can I pick up the... The, no, I'm going to pick up the the, the cloak, cloak and I'm going to drape it around him. He can do with it what he wants. It's just... As you fling it and it is in midair coming over his shoulders, he slices right through it. Oh. And it falls, nice. it falls in tatters at his feet behind him. Guess I'll be removing that from my inventory. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sorry. As he turns, yeah, as he turns anymore, back, anymore. there's still there's still no bloodlust on him at all, and he <laughs> he sort of bends back down to you, going like more, more pets. <laughs> um, I ask him why the people <laughs> summoned here. him and why did they die when they did it. Don't smash Say again. me. I asked him um, why the people summoned him and why when they summoned him, did they die? It is at this time that you find out the gray wolf has mental prowess. <laughs> the great wolf lets you feel like it, he sends a message non-verbally to you of his essence his, like what he is made of is red's fears and doubt and negative emotions that she didn't want so things that hold that held her back mm -hmm. right those are negative emotions to any human the the spell that was required to uh, summon him again uh, overwhelmed the hearts and minds of people who were trying to summon him because it, it forced them to reconcile with their own doubt and fear and things like that so they all perished because they were overwhelmed by what they Sad were not aware that they had to face hmm. so their heart stopped in fear pretty much mm -hmm. and he you can feel the regret that he the regret that he feels as a result. However, he makes an emphasis to say, communicate to you, I did not ask to come back. Huh. Uh, hmm. Well, I feel like an asshole. What is the name of the, uh, the, uh, the girl who made the dragons again? The, the god? Palma. Um, Palma. Um, I ask him what he thinks of the slaughter that went on, um, and That's what he thinks hot. of... So like how she forcefully turned those wolves into, or those people into werewolves with the artificial moon. The feeling you get toward Palma is a deadly growl. The feeling you get, the feeling you get toward the fact that you guys killed so many werewolves. He understands why you did it. Mm -hmm. He understands what it means to have these creatures in the world. He's not happy about it because ultimately every werewolf is his child, his yeah. cub. But, again, he didn't know his power to create werewolves at the time. He didn't. He had no idea that he was able to do that. And so his teeth and claws are incredibly potent. Hmm. Because, I love this little tidbit, because he's the essence of fear, right? Red's fear. And fear can spread very easily if you say it right. So his essence, fear, spread through other people and, and corrupted them too. <laughs> but, um, 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 so Tommy is proud of himself. <laughs> really? We couldn't tell. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, I still want to ask you. Uh, do you know anything about werewolves? No, no, I still want to ask him. <laughs> what do you intend to do? He, there is an image of him running for the coast. Why the coast? You want to just be free? There is silence in your mind. Like, not like he's not answering, but like, sounds of... The sound of silence. 
muteness and <laughs> um, solitude. He doesn't want to be bothered, basically. Am I able to think of something to say without actually saying it? And then he would be able to interpret the message because he's already in my mind. Can you say that again? Am I, am I able to think of something I wish to say but not say it, but then he's able to get the message out of my mind because he's already mm-hmm. in my mind? Yes. Can they be a thought more intricately than you can with words? Hmm. I will say he is concerned from what he feels from you. He's concerned? Yeah. Because he feels that you are unbalanced, just like Reb was. Oh. Uh. Hmm. So I'm talking to Jeff. Yeah, right yeah, now. Not, yeah. Not Zilthin. I'm yeah. talking to Jeff. Does Zilthin right now feel fear? No. That's what I thought. No, no. <laughs> this is there. Jeff talking to the DM. Okay. Right now. Um, uh, actually, this is Zilthin talking to the DM right now. Um, <laughs> I, I, <laughs> God. <laughs> we God. need to talk. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I, I'm se- I, I, I'm it's seeing the great so wolf. <laughs> God, um, I'm seeing I'm seeing the great wolf as uh, a tool. <gasps> That's mean. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's a little mean. In what way? He could be useful. In what way? For killing. Like you use him to kill others, meaning you mean? Yeah. I just don't think that this wolf really has a mindset to kill so that character is going to subdue the thought and let him run to the coast (laughs) (laughs) I had a bad thought but that's not something that uh, I had a bad feeling about this I was thinking about like conveying the image of that fucking island where the dragon was and be like I'm curious what would happen if they fought (laughs) (laughs) that'd be awesome Right? Bad I know. Uh, Thomas, Thomas feels like a dick. He's, he's born for once going to be a good person. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> be free! As he snuffles right next to Jinx's face, saying goodbye to her, and looks at each of you in turn, he looks at Zilthin last, and looks directly into your eyes, and charges you. Damn. And his claw pierces your your chest. He lets go, and he charges off, leaping off the fortress and into the forest. <laughs> you feel the fear of death for the first time. Hmm. So instead of it being necessarily a negative thing, hmm. he has put a new emotion in your repertoire. Yeah, but it is not necessarily a happy one. Yeah. But you also, through it, find a preciousness of your own life. Mm -hmm. So it's double-edged sword. Yes. Yes. All of y'all receive 1,500 XP for completion of this quest. Ding. Ding. Uh, We have to go turn into the Guild of Red. Ding. So we didn't exactly do what we were told, did we? I'm giving you more than planned because you also spared the Great Wolf. Honestly, in our condition, I'm not sure we could have killed him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. A, yeah. But this could have gone... This Plus, could've, uh, I wouldn't have helped. This could have gone differently, though. Like, you could have threatened him and said, if you ever come back, blah, 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 versus attack, versus, yeah. you know, go on, be free, you big dog, you know. Mm. And you guys chose the, the hero's route of, like, well, I love you. I'm going to end session here. Well, I mean, we can go to the Guild of Red. No, I'm going to oh. end session here. <laughs> that way you guys can think about what you want to do as far as your reunion with the Guild of Red. Mm, sure. Because either, I imagine you guys are going to be kind of mixed about being walking in there going, I'm going to resign. <laughs> <laughs> or going like, I'm going to keep following this because it's beneficial for my pocket, but I hate your leader now. Or you're going to be all like, hey guys. We should kill I Red. I never heard of them. I really like Red. <laughs> <laughs> I just mentioned walking up to you. Like, I knew that pink was a better right. color. <laughs> Jenny. Jenny, Katie, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jenny's the <laughs> <laughs> What did I do? Uh, what did I do this time? Jesus. 
Mary Joseph. Jesus, Mary Joseph. Um. Ta da! Ta da! <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. Bye bye. Ding ding ding. No, what's there? Don't forget to subscribe. We're like a radio. Don't forget to subscribe. 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 Yeah, Katie, subscribe. I'm him. Uh, oh my god. god. I'm freaking awesome. <laughs> I feel like we're a radio station and they play all those random sounds. <laughs> yeah, those random sounds. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> Sayonara, dude. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I just realized. Dude, the candy. I'm still recording. Really I, have a little slice <laughs> of I just realized Cousin something passes. very interesting, what? which is kind of dumb. What? Uh, so, you know how I like was all upset about the wolf wanting to protect it? Yeah. This literally, like, we symbolized that earlier with the spider. <laughs> uh, <laughs> see? Oh Save the spider. You see? Spider. I don't know what it is about me and, like, sentient things, but I know spiders aren't sentient, but, you know. I really, really wanted to, like, command the wolf to go, like, go kill things. Uh, so, is that what yeah. you're trying to do? That's what I wanted to do, but I was all like, oh, this wolf isn't... There's no way. This, I feel an imbalance in this wolf. So fuck you, <laughs> You need like super tame. <laughs> yeah, yeah, super tame. It reminds, super tame. It kind of reminds me of uh, Princess Mononoke. Yeah, yeah how Princess Mononoke. Yeah. Such a good movie. Yeah. So I'm genuinely curious. Please indulge me with this. What do you guys think of how I twisted that story? That was great. I liked it. Good. That was awesome. This is also really meta. Like it was solid. I'm gonna I'm actually. Ex- I'm gonna.